<clears throat> wow, Frost not being on time. What? I'm on time literally every day. What is this slander that you're trying to bestow upon me? I will not stand for it. I am sitting. Hello, hello, everybody. Hi, Chat. Yeah, I tried to get as unhinged as possible today with the going live notification while one, not getting banned, two, uh, staying accurate to what we're doing today on the stream because we are indeed doing some milking. That is accurate. We are accurately doing some some milking. Ah, oh, good to see ya. Good to see ya. Volpab, thank you for the four months. Thank you, for subscribing. thank you, baby. Thank you, thank you, thank you. The real Ishmael day for the seven months. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Appreciate you as well. Arson is really bad. Change my mind. Thank you for the 19 months. Hey, that might, I, I don't know if you got cut the social cue, but I don't know if I wanted to be sniffed. Please. Lots of love in chat for the early resubs. Ugh. Ugh. Just found it on YouTube a few days ago. I love the content. Zendy, good to see you. Hello, sweetie panda. Thank you for the 13 months. Ale whale, thank you for the three months. Resubs on resubs on resubs on resubs on resubs on resubs. About milking is the wall. You see, when you. He tried to finish his sentence. He really did. Yeah. But he was so distracted by all of chat's love and affection. Where. I don't know what love and affection you're talking about. Oh, well, thank you for the three months. Mm -mm -mm. My first streamer I've actively tuned into for, and I'm happy to be here for the milking stream. Hello, hello. Jay, thank you for the five gifted. The green key is yucky. Make oh. it go bye-bye, please. Excuse me, I'm so sorry. What up, lines? Oh, no. uh, new shirt. I think I've worn this one one time, and then it got lost in my closet because it wasn't uh, it wasn't hung up in the right place. So it got hung up in the shirts that I don't wear anymore, but they still fit me. So I'm not gonna throw them away. Fit place. <laughs> Zendy Carl, thank you for the brand new one. I, I go through that place like once every three years, maybe, and then give a bunch of shit away. But it got lost over there, and I found it this morning. Can you keep your shirt on this morning? It's it's actually a good one. Thanks. I thought my shirt yesterday was pretty good, too. Thank you for the brand new sub. I appreciate the hell out of you, dude. Wait, Kristen, where's the music? We enjoyed the tablecloth yesterday. I mean, this is kind of the same thing, isn't it? Is it hedgehogs on the shirt? Yeah, it's hedgehogs. And he got little leafies with him. Because hedgehogs like to crunkle little leafies. They like to eat them, too. Yeah. <clears throat> Bitch. Tignal. Tignal. 
I can't say that that wasn't. I can't say that that was a very smart move. <laughs> I I can't. I can't. Is, is it a goaded move? Hey, it might be. Is it a pogged up move? It might be. Was it a smart move though? Luster Frost Prime any percentage. Ah. I love Twitter. Hey, but you're the top gifter of the week now. Can I get some pogs? This dig don't even play League. I don't know. But the reason why I say it's not the smartest move is because we're doing content and then I'm playing League. There was time to hit the sub goal. And you could have waited for, like, you know, anybody else to gift any other amount of subs so you don't have to gift as many yourself. I don't know. Um, <laughs> Zeal, first time chatter. What's going on? Jesus fuck, man. I uh, Color me uh, officially flustered. The new shirt today is already doing wonders for the subs. Tignol, could I have 76 gifted subscriptions? All because of the shirt. I saw your Hot Ones video. You're interested in meteorology. If you ever want to ask less, learn about the job, feel free to hit me up. Binary Storm, is that actually what you do? Wait, really? All right. Second I get canceled, I'm coming your way. <laughs> Pransy, I'm thinking of the five gifted. My internet is bugging. What happened? Uh, you gave me four hundred dollars worth of subscriptions, and then I called you an idiot. Is that is that track? <clears throat> you guys want to see my pants, I, dude? I'm like I'm like actually I'm unhinged today, left and right. Going live message said, "Please come and milk me." Time. I give the five gifted. I have taxes to pay, unlike some people. Bro, I pay more taxes than you. I guarantee fucking tea it, all right? You shut your goddamn mouth. Stop saying that I don't pay my taxes. This tax season, for like a month out of the year, I need you guys to be sympathetic about having to pay your own taxes as a self-employed sole proprietor. It fucking sucks, man. It sucks. Tell me, Kranzia, how much did you pay in taxes last year? Or how much do you estimate to pay this year? And hey, I'll just, I'll say, I'll say higher or lower. If you feel like sharing. If you feel like sharing. You don't have to share that. Hey, Gab Baker. I would like some milk. I'd also like a level nine hype train. Oh my God, we're there. Holy shit. You paid one K. Yeah, definitely pay a lot more. <laughs> Sympathetic. Are you early today? No, you just haven't experienced daylight savings time, but my country has, and so I have to then appear like I'm streaming early, which is weird because no one really said anything the last two days, but today, multiple people have already gotten weirded out that I'm live at the time that I'm live. It's weird that no one said anything Monday. No one said anything Tuesday. Like, no one came in and was like, wait, why are you early? But then today, within nine minutes of the stream, more people have said, yo, why are you early than the rest of the... <laughs> than, a, than the rest of the thing. Opinion on daylight savings? Is there any... Have you met a single shred of a person that likes go that likes changing their clocks twice a year? What, what, what are you asking for on this? Are you... Is, is it like if I'm like the one guy that says I like daylight savings time, then you're like, oh, we got him. Cancel him. You were one minute early. Bro, I'm not one minute early. Look at, look, I sent this out 10 seconds after I went live. 10 minutes and 33 seconds I've been live. 
38, 30, 38, 39, 40, 41. It's literally tracking exactly with <laughs> is this is tracking exactly with the with the time of the of the day. Thank you for subscribing. Down this is tracking exactly. I mean woof. It sounds like your clock fucking sucks because I am live at exactly the correct time. Unless my clock sucks. Granted, I haven't restarted my computer in like. Why you are early? We are just happy to see you, Frost. <laughs> oh my bad. Hello, I don't know. Thank you for the one thousand bits. Hello, Mr. Levstonian. This is my Dude, level nine hype trade. Jesus Christ. Support you. Consider my content tax paid. Uh, Zoro, think of the eight months. Isn't it crazy the level nine hype train is as hard as and is unlikely to happen as it is, right? We're all pogging that it exists. Right? The highest hype train that we've ever had is double this. What the fuck? <laughs> what the hell? Instead of waking up next to someone, I love to wake up and bully a stranger on the internet. <laughs> I'm David the four months as well. Max was five up until about six months ago. BTW. I also subbed, so I guess you got five subs off me. Just came from the Was it on my birthday? No, it was on some random ass day. Love it. Chad just went crazy. Content we doing today. Map edit. Packmaster. Packmaster map edit. Uh check the schedule. Expedition point schedule. Or it's in my Discord. Or it's on Twitter. Or it's on the YouTube community page. I posted it all four places this week. Are you proud of me? Today we're doing a mod called The Milkman. It's, it's the, I'll show you a screenshot. I'll show you. Glad I made it to Milky Time Puppies. <laughs> Every time I see it, dude. <laughs> <laughs> Crank it. Big white round. Thank you for the two months. Ending out the hype train strong, baby. You just handed me a jar of your cum. That's, I'm not going to drink that. I'm not going to do that. Is it by capitalizing every word in your sentence like you're titling everything a YouTube video? Love that line, Brad. <laughs> <sighs> There's a surprise in it if you finish it. That is kind of the fun of a cum jar, huh? If you drink it all, there's a prize at the bottom. It's noon for me, and I only woke up properly. What up? What up? What up? I had trouble getting up this morning, too. I woke up at 7 and then laid in bed for an hour. Oh. But I feel good. The price is a tummy ache. I've watched the new YouTube banger or stay here and watch the stream. The stream ends eventually, Munchie. That YouTube video will be around forever. I've been waiting sick all day for you to go live. Well, now that I'm live, you better be better. <laughs> Dude, if I sleep in too long, I get a terrible headache. If I, if I sleep in too long, I get a mega headache. Favorite monster flavor? Um, Definitely, it, it's, it's, it's a lot of the ones that don't come in 12 packs, but the white one's my favorite just because I could buy it in bulk. <laughs> but... Frost, I'm sick. Just be better forehead. Yeah. He'll be back after stall to send funny 200 bit messages and troll YouTube. I I love that. I love I love that. Absolutely. Please spice up my YouTube content. That'll be five hundred dollars. What am I niece providing coaching sessions in the hit game League of Legends? Do, 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 do. Boo. No, you're better help. I thought better help was actually pretty sick now. 
Like I thought it, it, they actually like turned their shit around and are quite respectable. Maybe I'm wrong. There's a game called Spirit Abyss. You gots to check out. <clears throat> Mix of Isaac and Spelunky. DM me the game on Discord, Gunderson. Okay, back what goal did I hit? And I don't play a lug, but I do play Smite and a little Dota 2 for those who asked. Also, are you still thinking about the Gauntlet Challenge? Uh, yes. Yeah, that's next week, yeah. Yeah, you said the 21st or the 22nd, yeah? Either your birthday or my mom's. What is the content tax reward? It's you paying your fucking taxes. Do it now or else. We have about 40 people a day. I will say this. About 40 people a day press that content tax reward, and I never mention it. <laughs> what is going on, guys? <laughs> I love it. I love it. I love it so much. No blasting for the 13 months. 13 months of enjoyment. It's more. I clean it out whenever it gets above 30. Tax has been paid. Dude, you want to you wanna talk about real content taxes? This was my offline chat yesterday. I'm here too. What did I miss? The stream. <laughs> and then sub, 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 sub. There were two more subs after the screenshot overnight. I love this. Want me to not clean it out for? Yeah, clean it out like right as I go live every day. Thank you for oh, Dover, thank you for the brand new sub. Foreman, thank you for the 50 months. Handling, thank you for the five months. There's some damn Joels in chat. I want to see nothing in chat but Joels. How much ends in Frost Pocket after I watch the pre roll ad? Uh, 0 0.000001. <laughs> In reality, like, I can't tell you exactly how much I make off of ads every single month on Twitch. But before the decimal, there's sometimes three digits. <laughs> Remember to not say the word rat? Oh, yeah, dude. Steve uploaded a YouTube short to go live today. I'll let you watch it right now. And I want you to find the time that it gets demonetized. Find the second that this YouTube short gets demonetized. Okay? It's called Careful Squidward. I, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna let you watch it. I'm gonna turn up the volume, and I want you to find the moment that it gets demonetized. I would love for you to, I would love for you to tell me when it gets demonetized, because this has a yellow ad incentive. It, it is, it is limited ads because it is, uh, it is too scandalous. Okay, you ready? Here we go. It's a rat. <laughs> Where did, it, where did it? Where did it? Where did it get demonetized, guys? <laughs> why is? Why is this? <laughs> why is? Why? I I think that YouTube just really doesn't like rat. I think that YouTube say rat more like uh, that face is pure sex in the webcam, probably. Dude, literally, Joe Biden farted the other day. Two days ago, Joe Biden farted. That didn't get demonetized. Zagarat, thank you for the 23 months. Thank you for subscribing. No comment. YouTube probably thinks rat is derogatory. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. I don't know. But uh, hopefully they get back to me on that one because I, I did appeal that. And I feel like they should, get they should get back to you pretty fast on whether or not a... 10 seconds short should be monetizable or not. Crystal Song is going to see you though. Don't worry, we're uploading, um, we're uploading a Joe Cat VOD instead. A Joe Cat short's coming. Are you still keeping up with League? Mas o menos. Spanish for more or less. Um, yeah and no. I haven't seen the, the, what is the new champion? Milo or something? Joe Cat one is uploaded. Joe Cat is a perfect human being
Boo doo 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 boo doo. I really like the jam design, to be honest. Reminds me of Bard. Hell yeah. Yeah, no, everyone seems to really Again, like it. Remember that time Biden farted in England and it made the news? I can't say that I do remember that, actually. I would wish that I did. I love to meme on any sort of large political figure as much as possible. And you stumped me on that one. What time's it on my end? Mountain Standard Time, Zendikar. I'm in Colorado. Andu! Thank you for keeping me company on YouTube in the last four months of unemployment. Here is a tip from my first salary at the new job. Dude, congratulations on the new job. Thank you for the fucking 20, you motherfucker. I think of some showmakers in chat directed it completely at Andu. What the hell? Thank you. His alt cleans crowd control and heals. It's disgusting. That sounds fun, though. That sounds kind of fun. Do, do, do. Do, 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 do. Yeah, it's been a wild couple of days, man. Perfe perfect pronunciation of my name. And do first time chatting. After giving me $20. Can you imagine? <laughs> can you fucking imagine? What the hell? <clears throat> do, 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 boo. It's weird. Shorts don't show up on my sub page unless you click post and notify. Yeah, yeah. And that's kind of like what I want with shorts. Is like, I don't need for people to get notifications that I released a 10 second video. If you're just doom scrolling while you're taking a poop, it's going to go Andrew Tate, uh, The Flash Season 2, Barry Allen Fighting Zoom than my content. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> when it heats up more outside, probably early to mid next month, I'm going to apply at my first place down the street from my house. Let's go, dude. It's actually supposed to be like 65 today. And then tomorrow we're supposed to get snow. So I'm probably not going to be streaming super long today. We'll probably get into content immediately at an hour of stall. Immediately. No, I'm not even joking. You saying that I'm joking? I'm literally not. You don't believe me? Get the fuck out. Um, but I'm going to, yeah, I'm going to get into content pretty much immediately so that I can get off early and go spend some time outside with Hannah because she's pretty. As a Canadian, 65 is sun crashing into the earth heat. That's not true at all. 100 degrees is the boiling point of water. If the sun is crashing into the earth, you hyperbolic douche. <laughs> Sorry. I'm a, listen, I am a Fahrenheit defender, okay? I'm a metric system simp, just like the rest of us. Any, any good, any smart individual is a metric system defender. But I'm, I am a Fahrenheit defender till I die. Fahrenheit is just better for weather, 100%. For everyday use, Fahrenheit makes more sense. L, no, facts. No, it literally does. It literally does. Science, Celsius, keep it there. But for when we're talking about my temperature, all I care about as a human being is zero to 100 relative to whether it's cold or hot, right? Zero is very cold for what my body feels. 100 is very hot for what my body feels. Boom. There we go. That's, that's, there's nothing more to understand. I don't understand Fahrenheit. I literally just explained it to you. You say that, that Celsius is so easy to understand because it's zero to 100 is the boiling point, right? Zero to 100 is literally just hot and cold for the, for the human body. That's what it is. Meteorologist here, Fahrenheit has a much more gradual and precise scale. This is literally a meteorologist! 
as a precise scale for daily ambient air temperature. Celsius is based on the states of water and is more useful in scientific applications. <gasps> Boom! Get fucked by a literal meteorologist. Thank you for literal weather boy. A literal weather boy. Crystal Song, thank you so much for the brand new sub. I appreciate the fuck out of you, Joel's in chat. Meteorologists can be wrong. It kind of is their job to be wrong. But... <laughs> I'm just saying. I'm just saying, dude. As the guy that might want to start studying meteorology in the inevitable event that I get canceled on the internet. You know? Zero C is 32 Fahrenheit. If we add zero in zero C, how do we get 64? I'm sorry, Celsius believers, you guys have that guy on your side. You have that guy on your side. So I think that like ultimately you lose. I'm sorry. You you got you, you just lost. You're gonna have to backtrack and, and start becoming a Kelvin defender or just admit defeat. I'm sorry. Just... <laughs> it's supposed to get cold again on Friday. I think yeah, we're supposed to get snow tomorrow, and then I think it's supposed to warm up by like mid next week. Yeah, Tuesday is supposed to be like in the in the, the mid fifties, which. With the sun out, my guns can be out. Uh, Excuse me. Yo, Im, thank you for the three months. Hedgehog shirt, I love it. You wanna see my pants though? Doing wonderfully. Dude, am I just a menace today or what? Straight up. The bulge? Oh, did I have a dick bulge? So many brand new subs in the chat. What can I say? Very blatant bulge. See, Hannah made me feel self-conscious about my bulge. I'm going to be honest here. Because I like to wear I like to wear joggers. And every single time that I would go to the gym, she's like, I can see the outline of your dick through your pants. And I'm like, yeah, everyone wears sweatpants at the gym. Am I not supposed to? <laughs> like, what do I need to wear? Like trash bags? <laughs> what do I do? I don't <laughs> what, am I, what am I supposed to do? <laughs> Hello, Jonas. Thank you for subscribing. Flex badge founder. If you ever unsub, I'm taking it away from you. You know that, right? Learn how to tuck? Tuck where? Let people watch its community service flirt. Into <laughs> your ass crap. Tuck it in the waistband? I don't have an erection. What do you... Chet, that only works if you are rock fucking... Okay, we're not going into this discussion. We're not going into this discussion. We're not We're not going into this... We're, 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 we are veering off of talking about tucking my dick in any places. We're going... We're like, hey, let's talk about the hedgehog. Hey, look at the cute hedgehogs, man. Which one's your favorite? I feel so uncomfortable. I feel... I feel so uncomfortable. <sighs> Ross, this is better or worse than the billionaires are evil talk. 
I would say right in line. They make Only me feel equally as uncomfortable, but in different ways. To dick tucking. <laughs> they make me feel equally uncomfortable, but in different ways. Those hedgehogs are pretty on fleek. Macmish, I hate you, but I love you. You will not drop the word fleek, but you do give me a tier three sub. If you ever drop it, I'm bad. Was meeting the Duchess of Cornwall and let allowed one rip. <laughs> uh, I, I wear boxer briefs see i don't find box this is weird this is weird zenda carl i don't find boxer boxer briefs comfortable okay but then also as a swimmer for 12 plus years i found speedos incredibly comfortable so maybe i just need to go like thongs wait a second new tech <laughs> Wait, hold on. Is that the play? Do you find compression shorts comfortable? No, because those are like jammers, right? Compression shorts, so like jammers and swimming are the ones that go down to your knees. And then speedos are the the little tidy whitey looking things. And jammers are literally just compression shorts to me. They're they're uncomfortable. We're playing SDS again? Yeah, and then we're playing League fan games as long as this sub count stays above 6,400. Yeah, jock straps. Something like that, yeah. I mean, I don't want to wear it on my everyday, but... What is this song? Undefeatable. You are just weird. I mean, no, I think I think, I think think that there's a reason... Arbiter Daydream, thank you for the five gifted. I think that there is a reason why a nickname for Speedos is a banana hammock. It is nicknamed the Banana Hammock. And I think that that comes from merit. I don't think that comes from a place of... Like, I think we would have named it something more painful if it was more uncomfortable. Andu, thank you for the brand new Prime stuff. Thank you for subscribing. Much love. Joel's in chat. League fan games. Time to call PayPal for those subs the other day. Chat voted on it, Jonas. This wasn't even my choice. I... So last week during the wheel stream... Somebody put the option on the wheel to play a previously sponsored game. And then on Monday, we voted on what game that would be. And technically, I'm still technically sponsored by League of Legends via the part fact that I'm still in the League Partner program. So. Oop. <clears throat> I would it be funny if that. It's probably because I haven't signed the contract for this year. I haven't signed the NDA this year. I need to, though. There's a new boxer brief with a pouch. Link me to those, please, Steve. I would like to try them. I also don't like tight things around my, my thighs. And that's what I think boxer briefs do as well. They have elastic tightness around their thighs, right? I don't like that. <clears throat> Glad I got the stall. Feeling a little bit down on my luck right now. I'm sorry, Z Slayer. Oh. No die high frost. I'll go knee high. Except until for two days from now when I'm getting a big tattoo on my calf. What am I getting on my calf? It is an Into the Spider-Verse tattoo. It's going to be the, the picture that really resonated with my tattoo artist. Let me pull it up. I was like sending her a bunch of screenshots from the movie, tattoos that inspired, that I really liked. Um, I want to fill up my left leg just with movies. I just want it to be a collage of movies that I very, very much enjoyed. Um, this picture. Like the comic book style. I really, I think I'll probably, I kind of want Leap of Faith. I don't know. <clears throat> yeah. I don't know. Either that or like the graffiti that says expectations. I really, really like that. I don't know. As a as a person who suffers very much from imposter syndrome and 
you know, as a content creator online, I feel like we oftentimes give ourselves a, a big expectations as well as the internet as a whole has uncompletable expectations. <clears throat> I've never seen a tattoo that I'm more jealous of. She's supposed to send me the designs today. She texted me last night and said to take a picture of my calf. I am the milkman. My milk is delicious. Yeah? What is this? Oh, is this the... Is this the... Hmm. Men's ball hammock. <laughs> I love that. Can you send me a pic too of your, of your calf? Ross, do you suffer from making people come syndrome? Um, shout out to your tattoo artist. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, let me pull up her Instagram. I yeah, am this the is milk her. man. I'm a rich source of calcium. Boom, 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 boom. This is her. Boom, 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 boom. I thought your artist was Michael Myers. Yeah, this is a different one. See, look, this is my this is my Pacific Rim tattoo. <laughs> Any thoughts on the last of a show now that it's over? It had the potential of being a perfect show, and I do think that it might still be one of my favorite shows, if not my favorite show of all time, but I do not believe that it is perfect. I think the the last episode was too fast. Not to say that it didn't wrap up the first season uh, in a nice little bundle, but there was no reason that they needed to end on episode 9 with the shortest episode of the entire season when they could have drawn out that singular episode or just made a fucking second one. They could have they could have done the plot from episode nine over two episodes and it would have been awesome. And nobody would have nobody would have been pissed off. Oh my god, ep who there's ten episodes? Like nine feels like a weird number. That was the last episode. It literally ended at the exact last moment of the of the game. Ten million dollars budget per episode? show <laughs> you're gonna do dude they have the 52 months Thank you for big hollywood 10 million dollars per episode is is hbo max game of thrones quick question this is mod about the milkman from psycho norts is the milkman a big blue milk carton Bella Ramsey deserves an Oscar. I think she deserves an Oscar for the scene um, from, was it, episode? Again, no spoilers. We're not talking spoilers. From, what is it, episode seven? Maybe six? When she's getting angry? When she's getting mad? <clears throat> Too spoilery, Zandy Carl. Too spoilery, what you're saying. What's your statute of limitations on, on spoilers? I don't know, man. Just be respectful. What up, Dawson? I think in a live setting, it's really difficult to talk spoilers because I can say, yo, I'm going to talk spoilers. And then start talking spoilers, and then somebody who didn't hear that yo then comes in 10 seconds later and gets spoiled. And that sucks. I think spoiler-filled reviews is really just something that should be held to YouTube. Yeah, I don't know. 12 years. <laughs> I don't know. I mean, definitely by the time that the, the second season comes out, but like, it's all depending. Did you like Puss in Boots too? I almost got a tattoo of Puss in Boots too, in in place of what is now the Into the Spider Verse tattoo. Into the Spider Verse was my second 
choice. You can title the stream spoilers. Okay, somebody logs into Twitch and then are scrolling through their followers list. I then change my title. Their cache doesn't update because they didn't hit refresh. They join the stream. They get spoiled. Oh, you can put it on stream on screen. Okay, well, it you know, they, again, were scrolling down and the thumbnail that was chosen was from the 30 seconds before I put giant spoiler warning on screen. Then they join in and are on uh, audio only mode because they're in their car and they uh, they they immediately get spoiled. You know, there's just too many, too many variables there. I don't want to be the person that ruins a show for somebody. Can't wait for League of Legends games since I never see them on YouTube. <laughs> That's probably because I haven't Old played it in like six months. Chat would read the stream title. Very true. Very true. Do you know how many people come in and say, what are you doing today? When it's literally in the title almost every single day. Today's a little bit more ambiguous, I will admit. But every single day, it is in the title in some capacity. Usually very explicitly written. Very, very easy to read details. Today, we are playing the Pack Master. Yo, just, what are we doing today, man? We doing some Slay the Spire today, you think? So. Wait, the title is readable. Went to an amusement park and carved into a wooden railing. Dumbledore dies, and that's how that got... And carved into a wooden railing was Dumbledore dies, and that's how I got spoiled. Jesus. I can't read. Sorry, Kenny, I'm... Can't help you. I'm sorry. Thank you for the 34 months, though. I actually got a message from my agency today with three different games, and they were like, yo, do you want to get sponsored by any three of these today? Right now? New Slay the Spire update looks weird, to be honest. We're going to get so many of those comments during League of Legends, and it's going to piss me off in every single person in chat. Raid Shadow Legends? No, they were actually... No, they don't... My agency knows me at this point, chat. They know me. They don't bring me those kind of games anymore. They did at the beginning just to, like, be like, yo, like, what are you interested in? Like, want some Clash of Clans, you know? And I was like, no, I'm just not really interested in, like, the, the mobile gotcha universe. No, it's just not for me. And they're like, hey, perfectly fine. And so, yeah, the three games that they brought today are just games that are dropping or have dropped recently. That, honestly, I would have... Potentially taking all three of them. I would need to look more into them and like the reviews and stuff, but Wait, we are supposed they didn't look all right. To be able to read. They didn't look all bad. We just throw money at you and have a good time. That was the last time you played League? We'll check whenever we get in. I'll check whenever my last game was. It's been a minute. Names? I'm not going to name names. It's, 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 I'm not going to name names because they might offer to sponsor me, you know, contracts. How did balloons go? Apparently, every major streamer on this entire platform loves balloons, except Dan Giesling, who didn't even know what balloons was. That's weird. But either way, um, started up balloons. Within the first 10 minutes, Ots Varda joins my stream for the first time. I've been a viewer of Ots for years, and I was in his chat one day and finally mustered up the courage to talk. And he was like, yo, another partnered streamer? I'll give you a follow. And I was like, he probably does that for everybody. He's never going to show up. Lo and behold, yesterday... Guess who showed up and said this game has taken years off my life? Cutie patootie. Sexy man. Then, 10 minutes later, guess who also shows up? Legacy Bloons Enjoyer. Aliens Rock. First time chatter as well. Said, yeah, I used to. I'm glad that I transitioned my content away from Bloons so that it wasn't just bottlenecked. And I was like, who are you talking to? I used to be a league YouTuber. And he said, my condolences. Yeah. It was fun. It was actually really nice. It was really, really good. And I beat my first ever level on, on Impoppable. I've never done that before. I'm convinced Dan doesn't know how to separate the BM. He has to know what Bloons is. He, I can tell when Dan is pure BM and when Dan is being real. He had he has no idea. He had no idea before yesterday what Bloons was. <clears throat> and I'm plans on doing a chib stream? Potentially. What up, boy? Sorry to hear that you have uh, COVID, dude. But no, balloons is good. I like balloons. Balloons is fantastic. Ots is one of the first, uh, the three streamers that I watch besides you. Ots is good, man. I just I like him for his uh, his his general positive attitude. I, I like streamers inside of spaces that 
tend to have a more negative and <clears throat> um, pessimistic attitude towards their community have a more, or at least attempt to have a more happy and optimistic outlook. And I know that he's struggled recently with, with DBD and like the state of DBD and things like that. But for the most part, you know, I watch him. I like to watch in League of Legends. I like to watch the boss or I like to watch Broxa because I think that they are still very positive. I'll watch Rush sometimes at night because he's a little goofball. Um, how did Bloons go for variety? It started out with people giving me genuinely good advice. And then by the end, it was just people saying, I like this tower the best. Use this one. <laughs> the Dude, the boss follows me. He's actually one of my biggest subscribed people on YouTube. And he follows me on Twitch, I'm pretty sure. He be lurking. <laughs> Your top five medium to small size streamers of all time. I think that I am potentially number one medium size streamer of all time. Yeah. Not currently. I think that currently goes to HC Justin, who's doing a big subathon right now and has over 10k subs. Shout out to him. But I think, in general, I am the like the number one, at least most subscribed to, medium streamer of all time, amidst no contest. Because I have consistently held this subscriber count, and it's not just like a num like a like a like a one time thing, you know. It's not like a kind of thing, you know. Right now, DBD is plagued with DDoS attacks. Yeah, it sucks. Would you play League with chat? <laughs> I thought that you were gifting subs earlier for the sub goal. You gifted me five subs before Tignal gifted 76 in order to reach the sub goal. I... <laughs> I thought that you were trying to reach it together. That's me just being me, little goofball. Are you better at SDS or League? Percentage-wise of player base, probably Slay the Spire. Oh, maybe, probably even. And I haven't played League in a while. Back in my heyday, I was probably better at League, though. <clears throat> I was probably better at League. I was, I was consistently high plat or mid to low diamond. So, if you consider percentage-wise of the game, that's like top 0.5% of players. So. When you swam, what was your best stroke? When I was young, breaststroke. And then when I was in my peak of my swimming career, distance freestyle. 500 and up. 500 was my best event, though. That was the one that my coach wanted me to go to Olympic trials for. What ascension were you in the card map? Or I'm I'm on ascension twelve, I think. Yeah. What's my best stroke now? Definitely freestyle. It's the easiest one to do. Do you like? Did you hate butterfly? No, because I got I got away with the perfect illegal kick, because I had the smallest amount of a breaststroke kick at the end of my butterfly kick that didn't get me DQ'd. So no, I was actually really good at the the 200 and 400 IM. I had a really strong butterfly. It just wasn't the fastest, but I was a back half swimmer. So I could, or I was a, since I was a distance swimmer, distance swimmers tended to do well at IM as well because they didn't get tired out from sprinting because we go for so long. A sprinter, so somebody who's really good at butterfly and really good at freestyle, isn't going to go all out in butterfly because then they're going to be tired out by the time they get to freestyle. But I could go all out in butterfly, relax on backstroke because I, I was fucking terrible at it. Breaststroke takes no effort at all and then kill it on freestyle back ass swim time. You were Olympic level? I had no idea. I swam the 100 medley, but I failed pretty bad at provisionals. Yeah, no, I was, uh, I actually, um, I'm, I'm buddies with a guy named Townley Haas. If you look him up, he's the youngest ever Olympic gold medalist in swimming. Yeah, I swam with him growing up. And I was faster than him at the time that I stopped swimming at like 15, 16 years old. And my coach was trying to push me to go to Olympic trials. I probably wasn't going to go though. I needed surgery pretty soon 
on my shoulder. So it was a very low chance that I was actually going to make it, but I was fast enough. Guard you, they give the 445, dude. Thanks, Buffy. Appreciate you, man. If you had a good breaststroke, every I am or that is good at fly fucking hates you. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Dude, and so many people, like, they, they get inside their own heads. So they'd get ahead of me on butterfly backstroke, and then I'd come back on, on breaststroke freestyle. And as soon as you start catching up to them, their mental goes boom. <clears throat> my butterfly looked like I was dying. Do you have any clips? Or are you comfortable sharing them? I've asked my dad, who says that he has them on a hard drive, because he used to film me on, like, an old camcorder. And I, I, I've got, I know I have one race that I think was an, a thousand freestyle at like the age of 14 or 15. That was like actually one of the coolest races that I ever did. It's like a, you know, the thousand freestyles, like a 10 minute long race. But it's like, it's like I, my, my starts were terrible. I had terrible reaction times because of my Tourette's. I never wanted to go off the block early. So I would always just wait. And so I, terrible reaction times. So I always would start out in last place. And, and by the end of it, I think I was like first or second in the heat. But it was just like slowly but surely. I was clawing back and passing every which person. It was so good. Such a good race. What up, Balthazar? You ever got irreversible damage at the age of 22? You would have become <laughs> an Olympic swimmer. Yeah. Yeah. <clears throat> it's your personal favorite game? Mirror's Edge. I can't find the dude you message mentioned. Only Ox. It's because his name's spelled weird. Here you go. Bum, bum, bum. Mm, bum, ba -doom, ba -doo -doo -doom. His real name is Francis. <clears throat> <laughs> it's a family name. I think it's like his dad's name's Francis. His dad's dad's name is Francis. I never knew Colorado had a lot of swimming. I moved here three years ago. I don't know if it does or not. Hey, what up, Belly? Thank you for the six months. I will say Colorado sports is like one of the best places. Like Colorado or like anywhere high up is really a really good place to get into sports. Because then whenever you leave and you go like down to sea level, you're, you're like, you're a fucking superhero. Because all of a sudden when you have like double the amount of oxygen in the air, Holy! You still swim? I was for a minute. I was getting back into it for a couple of months, but then it got really cold. Fuck, man. It's it sucks going to the gym, swimming in a pool, and then getting out and walking to your car in sub freezing temperatures. So I'm gonna try to get back into it this summer. And also, I've been getting tattoos, so I gotta wait until my tattoos are done. <clears throat> Going from the hills to normal sea level, breathing is just so much better. Oh, yeah. Yeah. As a Floridian, Floridian, I hate exercising without max oxygen. I mean, dude, when I moved here, like, they say it takes a year. They say it takes, like, a year for you to actually get back to where you were cardiovascularly. It's, that's, 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 that's fucking crazy. That's crazy. Like, apparently it's like the hemoglobin levels in your blood or some shit. I don't know. Science or something. Do I believe in it? <laughs> Oh, I, I've got exercise-induced asthma. That's why I have to swim, Yellow Willow. If I want to do any cardio, I have to swim. I do that or like walking mine. up the stairs. Maybe. But then yeah. my knees suck. I'm excited to see him for the first time. Eskimo, thank you for the 17 months. I look forward to it. So in like a six degrees of separation way, you also know Michael Phelps. Michael Phelps is a douche. Like a huge fucking douchebag. Like, not even just in, like, the smoking weed way. He's, like, an actual fucking dog shit person. Like, apparently he was in the, like, the warm-up locker room or whatever. Like, as you're waiting for your heat before, like, a major race, you have to, like, wait in the locker room. And, like, he'd be like, <laughs> you guys think I should, like, place first or something in prelims? What do you guys think? You guys think that, like, I should actually try? <laughs> Who am I kidding? I don't really have to try and get first. Like, that kind of shit. In front of his fucking competitors. Sigma grind set. I mean, yeah, now he would be revered for that kind of attitude. 
Yeah, now now he would be he would start a great podcast. <laughs> oh man. <clears throat> yeah, nowadays he'd do well. Joe Rogan would invite him on as a specialist. <laughs> Honestly, you probably had a lot of internal shit going on. I mean, yes, if we want to be empathetic for a minute, but that doesn't mean that you have to be nice to him in the moment when he's being a douchebag in front of you. And honestly, a lot of top competitors are like that, especially in swimming. I don't know what it is about swimming. It's probably because it's so individualistic and doesn't rely on a team at all. It's probably exactly what it is. Because I know Ryan Lochte was like pretty much the same. Ryan Lochte was the same. Um, I had a, uh, fuck, what was her name? I had a friend who was on the female side of things and she was talking about top top competitors that were like openly douchebags to her. Like not just should I go out there and try, but like fuck you, you're nothing to her face right before the race. Bunch of wet, angry <laughs> individuals. Uh, uh. What's the difference between being a douche and overconfident? I think it's just a fine line of, of time and place. Like, do you think that him at the Olympic trials asking his competitors unasked for people that he doesn't know and don't know him, well, know who he is, right? Like, in that scenario, is is he not an asshole? If you're at a brutal orchestra, a couple people have told me about it recently, stupid name. First time chatter. What's going on, dude? Tempted within. Thank you for three months. All right, last song in this video game time. Give me some Ben Briggs before we get in. Ben Briggs one more time, and then we're getting into content. Yeah, I think, I think, I think, like, whenever it comes to, like, talking down to people, I think is, and I think overconfidence, I mean, the thing is, is, like, overconfidence is not even what he, oh my, he's sweating like crazy today. Captain Silverblue, thank you for the follow. Like, I don't even think he was overconfident. He just knew that he was that good, and he was just being a douche about it. I think whenever you're talking down to somebody, you're just being a douche. I think if you just talk down to someone, you're just a little freak. What is BMing? <laughs> BM stands for bad mannered. So it's, you know, just talking to somebody in a disrespectful way, in a rude context. In wrestling, I had to make myself feel like the greatest and talk myself up, but I would have hyper anxiety about the match. Yeah, 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 no, for sure. And I think there's like difference between like hyping yourself up and being in the locker room and be like, I'm going to go out there and fucking kill it, right? And saying like <laughs> like do you do you think i should even try because like let's be real here i don't have to you guys want to see me do that flappy thing with my arms it's actually provenly unhealthy <laughs> have we milked the milkman yet no we're, we're waiting for you zoo what's going on chris or they give the six months thank you for subscribing we move, we ball. I always hope such person then becomes last place. I always did the worst wrestling when I hyped myself up too much. I don't know if I would have been good at contact sports. My dad was really into wrestling growing up. He wanted me to do that. Guys are moving. Thank you for the 61. Thanks, baby. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Stupid name. Thank you for the follow. How long do you think you could tread water? If I can tread water, like, so like there's a, there, when, whenever you say like, how long do you think you could tread water? I immediately think to when we would have to do exercise treading, which is you would have to do freestyle kick underwater and you can't just do like, you know, the bicycle shit. If I can bicycle it, dude, I, I, until the same amount of time that I could stand on the side of the pool. Infinite. A literal infinite amount of time until I pass out. If I can eat piss and shit, I could go forever. Treading water is not difficult. Just got here. Are we talking about wrestling? 
No, not WWE. People were talking about their own specific experience with wrestling because I was talking about my 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 brief my brief uh, possibility of of becoming a professional swimmer. <laughs> what up, Zio? Welcome back, dude. Do you ever get into watching synchronized swimming? Nah. When I played football, we talked shit on to the other team to get under their skin so they would make emotional mistakes. Yeah. No, 100%. No, in that way, I don't think you're like, if it's a part of the game, I think that's great. I think swimming is a very much an individual thing where like trash talk is to pay content tax. No, what up, a boy? Thank you for the nine months. Stream. Like Remember trash talk is just Bezos box. is is not something that's welcomed, you know? Like it's it 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 could be there, but it's like everyone else just being chill and not being an asshole, and then you're the only one in the room being an asshole. It sucks. Thank you for subscribing. My brother in law was captain of Michigan streamer. team. That's pretty dumb. Dude, that is dumb. He's a fucking stinker. Twenty two. Hey, minion, you're a fucking stinker. What gives you the right? Where do you get off? Doo -doo, boo -doo -doo. Tennis has a lot of social wars about being nice. Right. It's like the same with a lot of other sports. Like, I think golf is like that as well. Like, there might be some, like, you know, some shit that's flying in the background, right? You're not, like, sitting there to people's face like, fuck you, missed this shot. Hey. I missed a streamer. You little turd. He just said He's hard. Slander. In fact, he is the stinker. <laughs> oh, my 22. bad. One's in chat if you're on Team Funky. Two's in chat if you're on uh, Team Sard. Now we know where we stack up. Sorry, I'm like, I've lost the mod in my list of mods. The milkman, I found him. Milk me? Suck me? Kiss me? I don't watch sports. <laughs> I don't watch sports at all, dude. I get bored of the Olympics, man. <laughs> you know the only sport that I watch, Dancer? And I think you would like it too. Because every single person has always liked this. There's the YouTube channel. World Chase Tag. Competitive and professional tag. It is literally the greatest sport that has ever been created and exists to this day. If you if you end up watching it, Kyle Soderman. That is my number one player of all time. At the time that I've last watched, he was still on the Hollywood Free Runners, which is a list of a bunch of stuntmen in Hollywood that then do this on the side as a fun thing. He is the greatest of all time. Ignatius, thank you for the two months. Best sport is professional slapping. I don't like professional slapping. I don't. I know, I know that like Charlie Critical's really into it. Love Charlie, love what he does. And like, you know, I know that like uh, Dana White is starting an unhealthy league of slapping, right? And, and like getting a bunch of criticism because he's not protecting the players. I don't think that you can protect the players at any capacity, even in the 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 part of slapping that they do the better. The, they have the more rigorous uh, safety precautions in, in place in the ones that Charlie likes to watch. I, I, I can't watch it because I'm just seeing people get hurt for, like, no reason. And, like, Badland, you're a thing of 58. Less than three. Seseldon, thank you for the seven months. Twinkie, thank you for the six months. And this is someone who, come, who, who comes from, I love MMA. I love good MMA, right? I'm not necessarily going to say the UFC. Some of the UFC is really good, but again, Dana kind of fucking sucks at it. I love MMA. I love boxing. I I, I love a bunch of the fighting sports, but I don't know. And it, and it just seems like, you know, with professional fighting, professional boxing, a boxer goes in, they do a singular fight, and then they take like six months off. You know? They recover. 
These slap boxers, man, they're going in. The swelling goes down. They're back in the fucking ring. What the fuck? Unprotected hits to the face. And then they're back there a week later. I, no. Uh-uh. I just don't like it. It's not for me. Cyborg, hey, they're the 1K. I can't stay but needed to come in to get some milkies. I'm at work hiding in the restroom ATM. Love you. <laughs> it's a fucking Jules and Chad for Cyborg. Thank you for the 1K. What ink am I getting? Uh, I'm getting uh, into the Spider-Verse tattoo. You see the XQC clip of him reacting to Critical and Sneak Owl? I saw last night... I don't want to get into this, dude. I, like, because I just don't fucking care. Sneak was a piece of shit. We all know that. Charlie flexed his guns in his video, and it was like... Cool, because he looks like John Wick. <laughs> it was cool, because he, like, he looks like John Wick. But, like, also, I don't know. I just don't care enough. It's not my battle, you know? It's just not my battle. So I just, I love Charlie. And I hope that he destroys Sneeko in whatever battle he takes him on in. Am I hyped for John Wick 4? Yeah. Why is everyone reviewing John Wick 4 right now? Like, reviewers are just dropping their, their review on it. It doesn't come out for like a week and a half. Like, this is the earliest I've ever seen people in, get review copies for a movie. What the hell is that? That's what I was saying. Dude, what the hell is that? CXSW just happened, I imagine. Oh, it was like a big film festival. Yeah, John Wick. Like, literally, people are... Like, reviewers are getting review copies of, of John Wick. And it doesn't come out until, like, the 28th. I don't know. Um... I am going to see the new Shazam movie on Sunday, though. A little excited for that. I do like... I do like... I'm blanking on his name, but I do like the actor that plays Shazam. He's a little goofball. Dr. Mustache Cat, think of the 14. I think he's I think he's a cute little goofball. Levi Zachary or something. Yeah, something like that. <clears throat> Reviews also come out when they know the movie is good. They build hype for bad movie. It comes out like the day before. <laughs> you know, you're not wrong. You're not wrong. I've just never seen it this early. I, like I've, I've never seen a movie this early. You want some Puss in Boots? Bro, I have seen Puss in Boots five times from start to finish. I wanted to get a Puss in Boots tattoo more than the Into the Spider-Verse tattoo. But my tattoo artist was not as inspired. This ain't League. Where the hell does it say I'm playing League right now? Where? When? Why? Where? Later is now. <laughs> the past is the present and the future is now. I haven't watched Puss in Boots, but I heard it's good. I think it's pre free on Prime Video now, isn't it? Am I crazy? Hey, what up, six -year? Time is subjective. If not, I know you can buy it on, on YouTube. I bought it, and I think it's worth it. It's, it's, it is, I think that it is, is as good as, as Spider-Man Into the Spider-Verse. Genuinely. If you, it, like, it, 100%. It's not free, but you can watch it on Prime? Oh, okay. Like, legitimately, I think that it is as good as Spider-Man Into the spider <laughs> Look at this little thing. Yeah, no, that's exactly what it was. I wanted to get, um, not, not to like say spoilers, but you know when the wolf is behind the glass and he he says his name and like the glass cracks and shatters? You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying, Steve? So like in that moment, right as the glass starts to crack, if you freeze the movie, it actually cracks in the shape of a wolf around his face. And it's all like purple and shit. And it looks so good. It looks so incredible. But then I sent that to my, I sent that to Malak and she was like, it's just a wolf. And I was like, you know, if you haven't seen the movie, it do kind of just be a wolf. <laughs> it do just kind of be a wolf. I can't, you're right. I don't know what to say. Did you ask the movie theater to deposit at that screen? I have it on YouTube. I can watch it at any point that I want. I can just pull it up. 
She said she would do it, though. That's the thing. Is she's like, I'll do it. I just won't be inspired. And I was like, I mean, if you're not inspired, then I don't want to do it. Look, it's Puss in Boots. Spoilers, he's got green eyes. What made you pick this random mod? It recently came out and it looks awesome. <laughs> the Milkman, a sentient cartoon of milk brought to life by the spire, manipulates future turns and even battles. At the start of each battle, gain three Calcium. Are you ready? Did I say cartoon? A carton of milk. <laughs> Oops. Are you ready? It's not the cum man. This is not the cum man. This is not cum. It's milk. He's got a bone He's to pick with the spire. Because milk br builds strong bones. It's, not, it's got nothing else to do with anything else. There's... <laughs> No, he doesn't have a boner, okay? He's got really fucking strong, big muscles. Because he's drinking bones. I mean, milk. Strike. Four strikes. Four defense. Stronger. Uh -uh. Stronger bones. is So, calcium is temporary strength and dex. Strength and dex. What's the upgrade to this? Seven calcium. So, it's like a flex, but it's just this turn oh it's next turn what the hell wait it's next turn interesting so you get to use all of your strength with it and then a one two punch a little bit of double d okay fuck around and find out shall we we will fuck around and find out will we not we could get the burning elite if we get lucky but we might just go this way instead we'll see what happens so yeah, he's got, I've got lactose right now. So I think if I do this and then I just block, go next turn. This turn I'm coming in. Giga punch. Okay. Spit tire. Why is he out of tire? <laughs> the hell? Retain, draw three cards, exhaust. Okay, I kind of like that card. Um, Gut punch, deal six damage. Enemy loses one strength. Wait, this is, this doesn't exhaust. Chat, this doesn't exhaust. Bucket strike. <laughs> Fuck it. We ball. The milkman. Start each encounter with five thorns. Glass cafeteer. Yo, workouts. Gain two weak, two vulnerable, but two decks and strength. Oh, God. We're taking this card. Okay, Calcitrate. Deal 8 damage. Deals additional damage equal to the calcium gained this combat. Duck and dive. Gained 8 block and next turn gained 8 block. I wonder if the... I wonder if... I wonder if I gain calcium, then I play duck and dive. If it would be 12 block this turn, and then next turn would be like 15 block because it would gain the calcium first. I wonder. Next turn, draw 5 more cards. Good night to rest. All right, let's take let's take workout, man. Trying to get this upgraded. Let's see what happens. A billion dollars. We could take a billion dollars and go there. One HP elite, anybody? Yes, yes. All right, let's do it. A billion dollars. Is this just Ted Nivison in disguise? <laughs> oh, I like that. I wonder what this does. Okay, I didn't know if there was some animation I wanted to know. Dex potion. Preserve. Gain 10 block in one dex. Deal 22. A knuckle sandwich. Months of luck. Luck. Thank you for the 26 months. Deal 22 damage. Next turn, target gains 3 temp strength and 3 block. Huh? No. Bucket swing is a fun card. We could go preserve, though. 
but I don't think we need it with working out. I don't think we need it because we can work out. What the hell is this? Frozen yogurt. At the end of each turn, gain two block for each retained card. We could also take a medical kit, but then we can't afford to remove. Last drop. Deal 50 damage and gain three strength. The problem with this card is not the 50 strength. It's already a better bludgeon. It's the fact that when you have a card that is big mana, big damage. Oh, it's lose three strength. Oh. I'm an idiot. Um, Gain two block twice. Hey, this is so good. Because it scales with your milk, your calcium. Convert your thorns to plated armor. Gain one thorns and one plated armor. But Wait, that's a sick card too. Okay, let's remove. We got to remove the curse though. We got to get rid of it. I'm sorry, chat. I'm sorry. I, I don't think we need any of this right now, do we? We could take the last drop, but we kind of counteracts with that. You could take cool glass. I mean, I think cross arms, like, literally just with with our deck scaling is, like, already eight block, right? Then plus the upgrade is an additional four. That's 12 block for zero mana. I mean, that's not terrible. Cross arms is, like, actually not. I'm going to take that. Okay, let's go. I'm ready to fucking blast. Boom! Butter dish. Your calcium bonuses last for two turns? I have fainted. Why does my swift potion look weird? Cool night's rest. Good night's rest. I think I want that. Next turn, draw four or five more cards. Let's take that. Okay. Let's upgrade our workout. Look so alike. Frost is the Turiel dad. Let's, I don't look like the I don't look like the milk guy. I don't. I tell him. Tell him that I don't look like the milk guy. I don't. Please tell them that I don't look like the milk guy. Wait, I kind of see it. He kind of looks like the milk guy. Look at this, dude. 14 block for zero. It's ridiculous. I will say some of the cards like kind of all look the same. Which, you know, it'll take some getting used to. Still chaos. Ma, it's not the milk man. It's a milk looking man. Okay, this is insane with good night's rest. Good night's rest plus espresso, and then you keep doing this shit over and over again. What's worse, being told you look like the milk guy or being called that your skin is great for tattooing? Oh, wait, now I see the resemblance. <sighs> Ziggy Stardust, the first time chatter. Yeah, every time that I do meet a new tattoo artist, they do tell me that my skin is great for tattooing. I think that just means that I'm really white. Like paper. I'm going to play... Um, the, no, the, no, this. And then I'm going to distilled chaos. Love that. Much better. 13's not bad. What does the milkman do? Uh, build really fucking strong bones, dog. What do you want? Check this out, dude. Boom! I got really strong bones. Like, incredibly strong bones. Odd mushroom is going to actually help with our workout. Wait, holy shit, I didn't even realize. Add X milk cards to your hand. They cost zero this turn. Wait, are milk cards specific cards? What's a milk card? <laughs> milk cards are strong cards that are bottled and exhaust. Says it on the card if it's milk. So I don't have any milk cards then? You want to know. <laughs> this, 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 this fucking, this fucking deck, this, this stupid shit 
this 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 fucking character has unlocked something in chat. It has unlocked something in you guys. Your bucket cards are played. We have bucket cards too. What the fuck is a bucket card? Thank you for subscribing. The milkman. Milk this run for all the content we can. It says it on the card, Tristan. <laughs> you like the, this has unlocked. This has unlocked a new type of BM in chat. This says this uh, chat is going a little bit off the rails. Bottle holder. Add empty bottles to your hand until your hand is full. What the fuck does an empty bottle do? What the fuck does an empty bottle do? Don't say it. Don't say it. Don't say the line. Don't say Wilson, they give it the six months. Wouldn't you like to know? Deal three damage, gain calcium equal to the unblocked damage dealt. Growing Pains seems, seems like a decent card. Exhaust your hand. Add one random milk card to your hand for each card exhausted. <laughs> I need to remove. Like, definitely 100%, I need to remove. Ryo, thank you so much for supporting my content. Okay, I really, really appreciate that. Remove another card, actually. No, I'm not even gonna, I'm not even gonna fucking transform. I'm getting rid of another one. It's gone. Because we just wanna, we wanna at this point just be like doing the same shit every turn. Upgrade. Boom. I don't wanna go there because I don't wanna like get 75 gold to remove, so I'll take a fight. Uh, good night's rest and espresso is pretty good. Could use some defensive. We'll figure out what bucket is. It's just chat is just nonstop being little freaks. Can I say that? Is that mean if I say that? If I mean if I call you guys, does it mean if I call you guys little freaks? Thank you for subscribing. Wow, already eight months. Help me. Gain two thorns and gain block equal to two times your thorns. Ooh, this doesn't exhaust. Chat. Wait, bottled card. When you play this card, add one empty bottle to your hand, which is retain and deals two damage and exhausts. Milk spill. Apply three vulnerable to all enemies and add... And it's bottled. So whenever you play a bottled card. Okay, we figured out what a bottled card is. We figured out what an empty bottle is now. We figured out what an empty bottle is. It's a retainable shiv. I think I'm going to take Trail of Glass, though. Let's take that. It'll scale really nicely. Um, I kind of want to upgrade Espresso so that we keep getting hella damage. Okay, let's keep that so that we can play Trail of Glass. Let's work out. Fantastic. Thorn me. Smack him. Wait, is this a milk card? Oh, that's not a milk card. Okay, good, 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 good. Good turn, good turn, good turn, good turn. Next turn's gonna be sick. Look at the D. And we have four thorns now. Cross my arms. Good night's rest. Strong bones. Full block. Reduce your strength. Take one of these. Next turn, we're going to have five, five strength, five defense, and it lasts for two turns because we have butter. Uh, let's hit you. Split you a little bit. This, uh, we don't mind our defenses getting reduced because people are just going to die. We still have seven strength and seven block. One, two, punch. Split you. Hit me with a good night's rest and a gig of thorns. Um, you guys don't die in one hit, and I think that's cringe. <sighs> okay, so probably just like die. Pick 10, but deal six back. Frost, I'm scared of this character. What what about them is is so scary?
I just arrived. Why is there a milk carton man punching slimes? I feel like we've seen weirder things on the stream. Have we not? I love that, like, some cards just scale with themselves. <laughs> that's, that's an incredible amount of block. Pasteurize. <laughs> Remove all debuffs. Not terrible. Wait, debuffs. I wonder, wait, is calcium considered a debuff? Is it strength down? Can we keep our strength? Thank you for subscribing. I, I wonder if it is. My milk is delicious. Okay. Don't say everything before months. I think it's probably just a runic dump. Our potions are doing well for us, but I would like some more energy as we continue to have a good night's rest. So, don't me. Calcium is temporary strength and dex, but on the next turn. But then with our butter dish, it lasts for two turns. Okay, this guy always attacks on turn one. This guy always attacks on turn one on low ascension. So now that we know, we can effectively block. Nice. So this right now says calcium come down. Calcium come down. Let's see. Boom! I'm pretty sure I don't get attacked this turn, but uh, just to be safe. Oh, it's not, it, it, that it was clearly spelled C-O-M. It was very clearly spelled C-O-M. It was very clearly spelled C-O-M. It was, it was so very clearly spelled that way. No, it was. Calcium went down. It was, it was very clearly spelled in a specific way. We don't care. Okay. Gain 12 block and 3 calcium. And it's a bottled card. 12 block, 3 calcium. Lactokinesis. Gain 16 block. If you play a milk card while this card is in your hand, it costs 0 this turn. You could take a milk coating. It's not a terrible card here, but I also feel like we're a little bit too defensive right now. We need to go a little bit offensive. Offensive, not... Duplicate a card. Double workout? Thoughts on double workout? Milk me, daddy. We could also go... You could actually also go double good night's rest. Double good night's rest is also not terrible. Double trail of glass? That's not a terrible idea. That's not a terrible idea. That would scale so fast. That would actually scale so fast. If it was upgraded, I would 100% do it. If it, if it, because it at upgraded, this scales by three. So I think I'm going to go double workout just because it's upgraded. Trail of ass. Got him, dude. This guy usually does the multi attack on turn one, I believe. I think it's a decent spot to use this. Guarantee that I get the draw off next turn while also not taking too much damage. Okay, so it's not guaranteed the multi attack. We're learning. More of this. More of this. More of this. Cross my arm. Thorns me. I went More defenses. Now am I Boo! Come fast, Words to live by. I give it the two months pounder. The simple fact that Gut Punch doesn't exhaust is no bananas. Dry, buddy. I, I will do my best to milk them dry, Critical. Thank you. Hit him with a one-two. Take him out. Pounder, thank you for the two months. Get some damn love in the chat. Morning. It's not morning. I almost said something bad. I almost said morning wood. <laughs> Just because I wanted to make a 
a phallic joke, but now I realize that if I make too many phallic jokes. Anyways, at the start of your turn, all enemies less than one with less than one deliverance have their deliverance increased to one. And it's when attacked, you draw a card. It doesn't have an upgrade, though. <laughs> card doesn't have an upgrade. I like this card. Oh, it's because it is upgraded. You're a smart one, Alti Energy. First time chatter, somebody give him a give him, somebody give him mod. You could also just take a nap though. Nap's not bad. So that you can continue to play off of like good night's rest and shit. Like less powers, more pogs. You know what I'm saying? We don't need to like go over abundance of powers. I think nap is fine. One in the chat if it's always a good time to take a nap. Thank you for subscribing. Ultimate Skyler. Thank you for the gift. Quasi, thank you for the gift as well. Maybe with one of these. Maybe with a little bit of uh Remove my debuffs. I really want a good night's rest, but I also know that I'm taking incoming. I'm slowly but surely we'll get there. I never thought I would see a carton of milk having a good night's rest and napping, yet here I am. I know, right? The world that we live in, so bonkers, right? <laughs> Such a weird world that we live in. But hey, I just like that this mod is all about promoting a healthy lifestyle, you know? <laughs> That's really what I like about it. We're only getting four block there. Don't hit me. <laughs> Never punished. Hey, love you too, Tom Pocket. Thank you for the 33. Uh, I think spare tire could be pretty strong. Again, we just want to like increase the amount of methods that we have to draw. Right? Our drawing applications. Remove a card. This is phenomenal. Finally get rid of a strike. Um, we could go this way, get double elite and a billion campfires, get everything upgraded. Or we could go this way and get a shop and a second elite, slightly less campfires. Thank you guys for all the love and recepts. We're on a hype train! Earlier hype train, PTSD, level 9, 76 subs. Putting us above the sub goal. You said campfire, interestingly. It's just because I want to keep removing cards, right? Like, I think this deck just benefits from being very tiny at the current moment. Snide with 10 motherfucking gifted subs. Let's go the dangerous path, yeah? Danger me. Um, could upgrade that. Could upgrade spare tire. Could upgrade good night's rest. I don't think you need to upgrade that right now. Could upgrade strong bones, though. Why is he breathing like that? Northern Lion viewer spotted. I still love the fact that Northern Lion was the one that let me know I'm a suspicious user in Dan Giesling's chat now, so that there's a little box around my name and Dan is more likely to see my messages. A little risky here. Doing a little bit of risky stuff here. Double workout. Take a little bit of damage this turn for a double workout. Do a good night's rest. Do you ever feel like chat is a bit too comfortable being horny on main? <laughs> oh, wait, is that milk? <laughs> hmm, I'm not sure that's milk. Yeah, not sure what that is. <laughs> I 
feel like I'm losing my fucking mind. Is that is that weird that I feel like that? No, you are losing your mind. Oh, okay. This deck is doing quite well now. I would like that to be noted in the captain's log. Sorry, repeat that. This deck is doing quite well. Rel? This deck is doing quite well. Sorry, drink again. Gain one thorns whenever you're attacked. Glass form. Shuffle one lost child. <laughs> Your discard pile. Wait, we could have we could have uh, taken the spoon and had this lost child infinite times. That would have been funny. I'm going to take glass form, though. I kind of have to do that. I feel like I am legally obligated to do that. Um, I think you could uh, definitely consider playing this, this, pasteurize, distilled chaos. Only nine block? Ooh. Okay, so maybe we're not... <sighs> Okay, glass for me. Defend me. Hold on. Cross my arms. More calcium, please. Which is gonna stay up because of butter. Yeez. Milk those monsters to get more potions. Supersize me. <laughs> That's a fun one. Supersize me. I don't know if we can do play that right now, though. Our deck is a little bit risky, in my opinion. I don't think we can afford that right now. Let's move on. Sundial is insanely good. We draw a lot of cards a lot of times. Okay. Love this. Big combo here. Huge combo, some have said. Anonymous, thank you for gifting a sub. I really appreciate that. Trying to make it say 420, I get it. Charlie, you sure milk that snake real good. I don't think now is the correct turn to play that second workout. Fuck, Our we're taking damage here. The new Probably have to kill him so we take less since they just gain strength. Taking so much damage, though. This is not looking good for the elite fight that I have committed to in two floors. Can I get a waffle, please? I think you could play this now. I probably should have played it first, but I think this is fine since we're already vulnerable. Sundial. Huge. Dude, once this deck gets rolling, man. Once it gets rolling, dude. Okay, Gamba Brew is good. We could take another cross arms. Ah. <sighs> 
Oh, hello, Mouth. Hey, Dion. Thank you for the 55 months. Beast, thank you for the follow. Do I want another cross arms? What does Calcium do? It is temporary dex and strength on the following turn, but this relic allows it to last for two turns instead of just the, the, the next one. Yeah, I think another cross arms is just a good uh, good amount of block. <laughs> Third workout. Ethereal heal five HP. Dude, we would have done well with the spoon. In three block if you has at least one Calcium. calcium. First time shatter from Fob, Fob Boy. I type first time chatter. Nice catch stream is wondering, do you ever get burnt out by making content? Yes. I do think the anchor is probably exactly what I want. <laughs> then we can do that and also remove another strike. I think this is going fantastic. Uh, dude, TTS bot, you went from being one of the biggest shit posters in my chat to being one of the most wholesome motherfuckers. I mean, you kind of always were because it was always supportive bullshit. But you just snipe first time chatters all day, every day. It's so beautiful. Genuinely. I, I really appreciate it. Glass form seems sick here. See if we can grab some of our cross arms. Okay. I don't think I mind working out. No, I think I'm just going to go glass form. One of these... A little punch to the gut. One of these. Excuse me, Mr. Streamer. You've got milk. Thanks. Because our thorns are just gonna build up and build up. Look at this. Boom! Yeah. Look at this. Look at the thorns. Look at the thorns, man. Less strength. Less strength. Less strength. This is only eight block. I think this is a good gambler's brew moment. Keep good night's rest. Gambler's Brew. Cross me. Eggs. Not terrible. We're taking a little bit of damage here. Sundial. Existent. Now I think we can work out. Work out. A little bit of pasture. Two block. Gut punch him again. Kind of owning. Tiny chest me. Discount dairy, add X plus one random mill cards to your hand. We still don't know exactly what mill cards are. Like, they're just random. They're just like a bunch of cards that have milk. These thorns are going to fuck up the heart. Absolutely, they are. Glass form is broken. It's very good against multi-attacks. I think I'm just going to double rest as I head into the, this fight. Unless we don't take a whole lot of damage here, then I might not. Okay. I mean, if we find bronze scales, too, it just gets, like, that much stronger, right? This guy attacks on turn one. But I think we'll be fine. We do a little bit of this. Give it a brand new sub, Dashy. Much love in the chat for Dashy, please. This turn he debuffs. This turn we're taking damage from you. That's fine. We can draw a little bit. See if we can draw, like, a big defend. Sweet. And now when we draw Pasteurize, boom, no more Hex. Trail me. Cross my arms. Cross him again. Good night's rest. Espresso. Cross my arms. 420 subs. One in the chat if you love being one of the 6,420 subs. Mods ban anybody that says uh, to or anything else. Mods, we really in this community appreciate one thing and one thing only. And it's an echo chamber of appreciation. <laughs> Yo! You could take a milk spill here. You could. You could. But is it really all that necessary? You know, <laughs> don't think so. Don't think so. We don't think we need cool glass either. It's just uh, a little bit over. We we took we took we took barely any damage. We could upgrade this. We could upgrade this. 
Gotta upgrade that. Gotta upgrade that. I think we'll upgrade glass form. Okay. Hello. Glass form. Trail of glass. Good night's rest. Okay. Boom! Boom! Snap. Hit me with one of these, because then if we draw... If we draw Pasteurize this turn... Well, we do keep it for next turn. I was going to say fuck. But we do keep it next turn, unless we can draw it here. Okay. Good night. Okay. Nine strength, pleasies. Pasteurize me, Captain. Sounds weirdly sexual, but it's not. Calcium. Gut punch him to make him lose one strength. The fact that gut punch doesn't exhaust and you can just keep hitting him with him. Keep making him take one of those. Nine thorns so far. Gut punch him again. I think, yeah, we're, we're at the point where we're like pseudo infinite, right? We're doing very similar things every turn. Why? Because they fucking work. The deck works. What more do you need? I've got 19 strength and decks. Seriously, what do you need? Infinite enough. <laughs> Our gain is 70, 102 block. This guy's out here giving us 12. 12 thorns. Boom. Calcium me. I'm just sitting here like this all fucking day, crossing my arms. You could use 100,000 stinky, stinky points to Thanos snap or nuke. It would be way more than 100,000. One in the chat, if you could use... If, if, if there was a 100,000 point reward to nuke, if you could do it right now. One in the chat. If you could afford it right now. You, do you see this? <laughs> you understand how desolate this chat would be for days. 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 Saying pasteurize me is infinitely less sexual than saying pasteurize me, Captain. Why he Pluto? Why is he blue? Chad, can you ban this guy? Asking too many questions. Asking questions they don't deserve the answer to. The milk milk is actually like the sky. Did you know that? If you if you take it outside, it'll it'll look mi it'll look milk. It'll look blue in the sun. You didn't know that? Um, bottle holder. Add empty bottles into your hand until your hand is full. It's a goofball idea. It's a goofball idea. We did figure out what an empty bottle does. Dented bucket. Yo, 25 damage. Whenever you use this card, permanently reduce its damage by one. <laughs> this is what Glass Knife has always wanted to be. I wonder if you use it and it goes down to like 20 damage and then you upgrade it if it goes to 30 or if it just increases it by five. I wonder. We still don't have any bucket cards. Right. Get it? Find out. No can do. Instead, should I take some whipped cream? That is whipped cream. It's it's whipped cream on a tongue. There's nothing else in this photo. It's just whipped cream on a tongue. If you play at least four cards in your turn, gain one extra energy. Next turn. Oh, we do this every turn. Please and thank you. Um, should we hit another shop early on in order to be able to remove more cards? We could go this way. Still get a guaranteed shop and probably get some fun question marks. Malfoy, are you still in chat?
Pasteurize me. One, two. Two months of frost's milk less than three. No, there's no there's no milk involved in this transaction. This character is incredibly fun, incredibly strong. I'm having a great time. The milkman is hot. Until I look at chat. Let me let me clarify. I'm having a great time. <laughs> Enemy loses 10 strength for the rest of their turn. Not a terrible one. Not a terrible card. We don't really have anything else that applies debuffs, right? Other than uh, the gut punch. And it would be nice to have something else that it could apply a debuff, but I think we would want that vulnerable card. Gain 10 block, but deal 4 damage. Hey, Bucket Headbutt's kind of a fun card. It's kind of a goofball card, isn't it? Double workout real quick. God, this whipped cream, every time it goes off, I get a little bit happy that it did. I'm like, ooh, yeah. This is nice. This is quite nice. No, it wasn't a cum thing. It was... Kind of has nothing to do with... I'm not... I'm not constantly making cum jokes. You know that, right? I'm a human being that just says normal sentences that you are perceiving as something related to cum, but it doesn't have to it has anything to do with it. It has nothing to do with it. Take a nap. No, I have to go play League of Legends with these degenerates in a few minutes. How does that feel? How does that feel that that's my job? My job is to play League of Legends with you. Humpty, thank you for the nine. I hope that... I'm here to pay my content tax. A R U G U L H I H U H A T H A. What are you saying? What are you saying? What, you... what did you just say? You want drugs? We could use like another good attack card, maybe. Your job is to do what we say, now dance. My job is to do what you say when you give me money. Let us be clear. Let me be clear. Defend, transform. We got a lactose intolerance. Deal five damage. Whenever you attack this enemy, it loses two HP. <laughs> I guess that is a debuff. Talk about a new debuff to add to the enemy. That's like a permanent choke. Permanent choke. Uh, we'll keep nap. Keep it to this. Yeah, a little permanent choke, man. Permanent choke, but just for attacks. Spare tire me into a little pasteurization. cream. <laughs> Nope, it's not. God, why is that so loud? Why is that sound effect so loud? Ow. What were you saying it is? Were you saying it's like cocaine or something? I love this, man. Look at it. Look at it just dealing damage out of nowhere. The thorns is broken. The way that we're gaining thorns as well. Draw me a billion cards. Give me a little bit of calcium. <laughs> Not broken at all. I feel like a lot of mods have tried to delve in down the thorns route, right? They've tried to go down the thorns route. 
And I think that every single time that a modder has gone down the Thorns route, it is fantastically too strong. We could take a preserve, but again, like I just don't think we need any of this. When you open League, I will automatically lose a third of my respect for you. Bro, do you not know me? <laughs> do you not know who I am? I'm the League of Legends guy. I'm the guy that does League of Legends content. Thorns me. Punch him. I don't want to play this. In case this is the big attack. Night Grim, thank you for giving this up to new, new MF. Cringe? Sort videos by popular. The Binding of Isaac! <laughs> Sorry to disappoint you. I am who I am. It with a good old one, two. Ow, that was a big attack. Happy milk day. Oh, shit, I should have reduced the strength. Oops. Hey, Lou, give me the 18. Okay, so those are all of my block cards. Can you do the big attack real quick? <laughs> no. These are all of my cards. Missed it for a bit. How are you doing, Frost? Hey, how's it going? If he's doing the big attack now, I might actually die. Like, there's a chance. Hey, okay, not the big attack. This is good. The dynamic Q square table, that was a banger. No. Trail. Again, we drew all of our block cards. Please do the big attack. Love that for me. Okay. That's good. That's good. That's good. Wipe them out. Wipe them out. Ink bottle me. Okay. It's like a missing person. No, I, I don't want any of these. I'm nervous now. I'm genuinely nervous for the future of this deck. <sighs> genuinely nervous for the future of this deck. Um, we should be fine doing this. Surprisingly, didn't do a lot of damage for having 10 plus strength. Yeah. <laughs> oh, no. No, man. Dang. It feels like... It feels like as soon as I... This guy's doing big damage to us this turn. I'm dead. I'm, I'm actually... We actually just lost unless... The spare tire! Spare tire. I need you to draw me the greatest card of all time. That... That counts. If this guy is attacking... 
We're dead. Not attacking. Okay. It just, it's like sometimes it just falls flat. Holy shit. The milk will prevail. Hopefully with the ink bottle, we're going to play enough cards to just like consistently get it off. Because it's definitely going to help. Set it up to be good next next fight. Milk bottle or ink bottle? True. In one thor thorns for every four cards in your draw pile. <laughs> I like that card. We have 12 HP. Bottled Tornado. Could put Glass Form in our opening hand, but like... We have 12 HP. We have 12 HP, man! And we have to take an Elite. 12 HP, and I'm required to fight an Elite. I'm gonna put a workout in my opening hands. Girdle. Curdle. 20 block and 20 block next turn, but lose three decks. That's not terrible. It's not terrible for us. Because if we use that early on in a fight, if we were to use that early on and it would go to negative decks, we could technically pasteurize it. But it's not, it's not terrible. And it is technically reusable. That I don't actually like. Wait, I don't like that it's reusable. <laughs> Wait, I actually... I don't like that it's reusable. Glass cut. Gain one thorns. Deal two damage. Apply two weak. Form of weak. <laughs> Convert your thorns into... Convert your thorns into plated armor or metallicize. That's insane. We don't want that. For what our deck is currently doing. But that's fucking crazy. It's really good. I think I have to take this pair. Is that... That's so gross to think. <laughs> I have to take a fucking pair? Pair of these... Yeah, it's literally an emergency pair. When Waffle would cost... Like two thirds of this. I don't think that it pairs well with milk. <laughs> oh, man. We are against Awakened One, which I think out of all the bosses, I think is probably one of the easiest to... My promo cone is not active anymore, Albert, but thanks, dude. Thanks, man. Appreciate you, Karen. You could take another trail of glass. That is a very real thing. Is you could just take another trail of glass. Our workouts get worse with the trails of glass, though, right? Could also remove, remove this to def like defend or something. Could remove calcium. It's actually not that good. Huh. Is this run a secret ad for milk? Yes. Yes, I am working for all of the big farms. Every single one. I heard that it was a really good way to uh, gain any sort of notoriety or popularity by working for big pharma. So, yeah. You know, they say all publicity is good publicity, so... hard man 
I could take Trail of Glass and then remove another card. And then we can scale really hard. Trail of Glass, remove another card. Trail of Glass, remove another card. Yeah. Remove Stronger Bones and then Trail of Glass. Strong Bones is like, okay. Is it better? I don't know. What's better to remove? Is it better to remove a defend? I definitely don't want to get rid of strikes. I feel like we're not... I mean, I guess you could remove a strike if you're getting another trail of glass. But then Strong Bones, like, also at the same time doesn't really matter, right? Eh? Why is there a tire in your deck? Because it's a spare. Cannot survive normal plus elite with 12 HP. Dot, dot, dot. Dot, dot, dot. <laughs> Can't wait for, I, for me to lose and then that guy type, I told you so. Save our pasteurize and our workouts for once we get debuffed on turn two of this fight. Thanks, family. Thank you for subscribing. You shoot that one a lot. Okay, gut punch him and then hold here for the ink bottle next turn. Perfect pasteurize. The perfect pasteurize doesn't it? Holy shit! It does exist. You ever burp and taste strong vomit flavor? Yeah, that's that's called acid reflux, dog. That's a very common thing that people have. <laughs> it's really common. There's medicine that you can take for that. Are you serious? Wait, you guys don't know that that's acid reflux? Hey, you're tasting vomit is is the reason that vomit tastes like it is is because it's acid. Acid. Um, we could wait to draw next turn, or we could draw right now because we have spare tire. Because we can draw into good night's rest. Are you fucking me. <laughs> I mean, you just got to love the content from this guy. Content is all right. Content do be contenting. It's contenting all over the place. Punch him. Him with the one, too. If I do this, he just dies to the thorns, and then we get to save Ink Bottle. Workout number three. Thank you. And soon. Fa. <laughs> That's not good. Um, chip. Just don't get punished. Perfect. We're not. Hey! Go for it! Not fucking punished! I'm not fucking leaving! Ink bottle. Pay attention to your ink bottle. Ink bottle is everything for us right now. Ink bottle is fucking everything, man. Bone me. 
reduces strength. Let's curse me. It's fine. We do have the blue candle. Which means we can't get cursed again, which means we can freely attack you. It's quite nice. Night rest. The night moon. More thorn. Feeling a little bit thorny right now. Punch him in the gut. Hit with a one, two. I do like one mana 60 block every turn. Quite nice. Sneko oil. Fortified calcium. The end of your turn, gain block equal to your calcium. Gain three calcium. Yeah, we don't need that. It's a cool card, though. Lose five health unless you have at least two calcium. Deal 14 damage. I think we can survive against the head like it's our damn job. Like it is our damn job. It kind of is. I, th I think we can survive against this guy so fucking easily. All caps spamming gets skull crack for next fight. Source. Dude, trust me. Stop! <laughs> There's actually an emote for Dude Trust Me. I kind of want to get it. Good idea. Wanted to see if we drew workout first before I play my goddamn Pasteurize. Let's fucking go, dude. Huge. Is that acid reflux? Strong bones to gain a billion strength and dex for the next two turns. Reflex this. Bro, I'm not quite following what you're saying, I'll be honest. <laughs> Cat cough. I love... Please, any time that I cough at any point during any of my streams or content or YouTube video, I just want you to think of this emote. That... That is... <laughs> That is entirely what I would like for you to think. That emote is the living embodiment of who I am. Spirit animal energy. Remember the guy in chat that said you can't survive you can't survive a normal fight and an elite fight with 12 HP. Newsflash, buddy! I survived two normal fights. I got a curse, and now I'm at the elite, and I've lost zero HP! Three months since I found the sussiest streamer on the Twitch platform. Good luck with the runs. Let's get Andrew some vid content. Bag of pee with the gambling sheep. Add one random milk card to your hand every turn. Why is it rear cattle? <laughs> we could take another good night's rest. If there's any card that I want, it's more rest. Report to support. Thank you for the three months. Ten Thank you for the seventeen. Rear as in to raise. Mm. I get it. I get it. I get it. Not a farm guy. Can you tell? Dude, I still... <laughs> Dude, I still... Oh, my God. 
I the, the one of the more tilting moments on my stream was when I was traveling across the United States. I, I streamed the entire thing. I rented out a, an IRL streaming backpack and I streamed to like 30 people just the drive across the United States. And one of the chat, if you ever go across country drives or cross country traveling, and every single time that you see cows on the side of the road or whatever transportation you're in, you point at them and you say, cows. What in the chat? Ball baby, thank you for the six months. Maybe you even play the game, right? Where you have to touch the ceiling because you see cows first. Yeah. I kept saying cows over and over again. I'm driving down the road like this. Actually, I drive like this. But either way, I'm driving down the road and I keep saying cows, cows, cows. Some dude in chat tries to bucket me and said, yeah, tell me that you're a fucking city boy without telling me you're a fucking city boy. <laughs> <laughs> the hell, man? Zarika, thank you for the raid, dude. What's wrong with being a city boy? Nothing, but it was also just wrong. I mean, like, yeah, was I born and raised in the suburbs? Yeah. But my mom, my mom was born and raised on a horse farm in the middle of upstate New York, and my dad is from Vermont. We are, we are very rural at heart. They just wanted me to go to a school they, and they could afford it. But then in my later years, they moved out to a place called Goochland, Virginia. <laughs> Does that sound very city-esque? Goochland? <laughs> yeah. That was the one time that my mom ever uh, called me on stream to correct me, by the way. As I said that she was born and raised on a 13-acre horse farm. And she called me in the middle of my stream and said, Hey, was just watching your stream. I wanted to correct you. It was only an eight-acre horse farm. We just would, like, use the surrounding land because it wasn't owned by anybody. Okay. <laughs> All right, mom. Actually, <laughs> actually, uh, do I take the second good night's rest? No, because if you draw them at the same time early on, it sucks. I'll lose seventy six to get a, a the, the weekend on turn one. That'll go fantastically in this this fight because we have to beat this guy with twelve HP. Yo, Astrid, thank you so much for the brand new brand new sub. You know our bunny's name is technically Astrid. Nobody ever calls her that, but Mr. Shroom, thanks for the follow. Double trail of glass on turn one. This is an incredible turn. This is an incredible turn. I'm pogging. I'm pogging all over the place. You could also play glass form, but I think we need... We could use potion and then play glass form. I'm kind of okay with that, I think. I mean, we're definitely crossing our arms. No, I don't think we need to do that even. I think that this is probably more than enough. No, I think I want to use potion because I want to play this. And then we don't play anything else. We get the whipped cream off and then get ink bottle per perfectly prepped. Yo, it's time to grind gaming. Thanks for the raid, dude. Hope your stream was fantastic. We're currently playing Slay the Spire. And we're playing um, as the milk guy. And you can't tell if... Every single card in this game is just because it's centered around milk or if it's like loosely centered around sexual things. Like trail of glass. How sexual. <laughs> he's got a lot of thorns and he's got strong bones. And he's got a bone to pick with the spire. Thanks for the raid, man. Appreciate you. We could gut punch this guy, but I do also want... I'm going to play this for sure. We lost one HP in this fight. I think I'm, I'm definitely going to do this. And then I'm probably going to start working on these guys a little bit. I could play workouts. I don't think I will, though. King shaming a milk carton. <laughs> Maybe I am. 
nice. Um, spare tire real quick to just find a shred more of block. Love that. Good night's rest into some damage. Boom. Three thorns pot looks OP when look at <laughs> looks OP when looking at the generated thorns. All right, trail of glass. Maybe one of these. Good night's rest. Good draw. Incredible draw. Mad clown. Thank you for the seven months. Max power. Thank you. Thank you guys for all the follows. If you're coming in front of any of the two raids we just got in the near, in the in the last couple of minutes. Uh, my name's Frost Prime. Thank you for subscribing. It's kind of on the masthead. I assumed you would have known that. Yo, Twan, thank you for the, thank you for the eight months. All right, I think we're good probably to play this. I think we're probably okay. With reducing their strength down to literally, sorry, literally, zero. My name's Frost Prime. Welcome to Jackass. Hey, guys. It's me. The Frost Prime guy. Wait, I have, like, no block in my hand. Can that help? <laughs> We're fine. Oh, wait, we can just kill him. Oh, they're just fucking dead. <laughs> imagine. Imagine being scared there. Did you? <clears throat> Not me. Take a nap. Gotta punch him. Strong bones him. Like, literally, sometimes we gain 226 block, and then sometimes we struggle getting over 10. Is that a problem with the deck? Is that indicative of a problem with the deck? You think so? We just play everything. Every single turn. It's awesome. I love dealing... 42 damage anytime that I get attacked. And then block for 226 again. This is fantastic. So what was that about not being able to survive? An elite? A normal fight? Hey Frost. Brave anything? Here. Not here to say anything mean nor weird or creepy or outright just confusing. Hey. Just here to say I love you and have a good day. Right. Can so I get a kiss? he churns with rage. That's what it said. See, I want to give you a kiss. I really do. I really do, Dr. Heap. But it, a lot of times in the past, I've been baited. In, I've been baited in this moment of like, hey, I'm not here to do anything weird. I'm just here to say I want to, you know, what I want to say, love and support. I've been I've been scarred with PTSD from this moment. <laughs> and you took one damage. I did take one damage. How dare I? This deck would benefit from a barricade. Yeah, what about a trail of glass upgraded? Do you need a hug? I would I could very much use a hug. Yeah. Very much. Very much. So please help me. Um, we do we do draw one card off of whatever we play on turn one, and we did draw Pasteurize, so we could keep this. I, I kind of want to get rid of Glass Form right now. Mm, no, I'm gonna keep Glass Form and get rid of Pasteurize. Okay, this is a good turn. We do have a nap to draw two more cards next turn. But we do have to worry about the amount of cards that we're going to not have next turn. Um, we do have a potion that we can use. Let's go ahead and draw, see what we get. Okay, not a bad card to have drawn into. I definitely think I'm playing good night. I, I, I definitely think I'm going night night. I definitely think I'm going for a good night's rest. I need to draw a billion cards next turn that aren't these cards. You know what I'm saying? Because like this can draw me to the end of my deck, but like that doesn't do a whole lot more. And then I can, like, shuffle a little bit. That just doesn't really help me. But do I play Workout is the question. I think so. I think it's fine to play Workout. I don't think we're going to take damage here. Frost says as he knows he's lying. <laughs> oh, no. All right. Um. Spare tire. We can Espresso into Nap. And a spare tire. That's a good draw. We can gut punch you, which is fantastic. Me when I lie. 
Uh, I don't think I want to work out this turn. I don't. If if it's not. I didn't say piss. I said pasteurize. I was not saying piss. I was saying pasteurize. I was nowhere inside of the, that sentence saying piss. All right, good block. I don't even think I need to turn around. Let's just keep hitting this guy. Nice. Fantastic. Love this. Okay, hey, nap. Cross my arms. Glass. Hit him with a good one, too. Okay, we need to we need to end this fight soon. We do need to end this fight quite soon. Pay attention to your ink bottle, Tristan. Pay attention to your ink bottle, man. Okay, big attack coming in from this side. I need to draw something hot here. This has to be a hot draw. Boom. Talk about a hot draw. <laughs> you know what a nickname for Frost Prime is? Hot. Hot, a hot, a hot. That's what my nickname is. Okay, pay attention to your ink bottle. Default man. It's not. No, my nickname is not. It's not my nickname. Delicious? No, it's not tea. Okay, prime the ink bottle here. Nice! Nunchaku in a distilled chaos. This is fantastic. This is phenomenal. This is great. Love this. Okay. I think we have a solid chance coming up in this fight. One in chat of you also do. Everyone knows that Frost's nickname is T-licious. This is an okay turn. This is actually an okay turn. I'm like actually pretty okay with this turn. We play workout, glass form, good night's rest. It's not bad. Yeah. We use probably two out of the three potions. <laughs> and like obviously like espresso nap. But like energy wise, I think this is fine. Okay. Workouts. Last form. Good night's rest. Nap. Espresso. Potion, potion. Save our distilled. Okay. Okay. We have a good chance here, I think. Okay, 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 okay. Minus strength is so good. It's pretty good. Okay, defend me. Thorns me. Thorns me again. Minus strength. Slime him. Parasite him. Could distilled chaos here, but... Because there's a good chance. I, 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 you know what? I'm going to spare tire. And if I don't draw pasteurize, I'm going to play my distilled chaos. Spare tire draws pasteurize, so I don't play distilled chaos. I think that was a good turn. I think that was good decision making. I think that was actually really solid decision making. I think that was very, very good by me. 19 thorns after turn one. <laughs> Imagine. <laughs> Imagine being that guy. Ugh, 62 block. Work out real quick. Yeah, I do work out actually. <laughs> yeah, I do kind of work out. <laughs> All right, good night's rest. Nap. Pay attention to your ink bottle. If you've learned anything from this run, chat, I want you to pay attention to your goddamn ink bottle, man. Jesus. All right. Trail of glass. 71 block. Cross your arms. Hit him with a little lactose. Good night's rest. Espresso. Multi attack. All right. So, I think we might have enough block. What am I going to do here? What do you think? I'm going to pay attention to my goddamn ink bottle. Hmm. 
Glass. Gut punch. Bones me. Good night's rest. There's two things you need to take away from this run. One, pay attention to your goddamn mink bottle. Rule number two, get a good night's rest. Make sure you're watching this video. You're watching this video and it's... You already know that you're going to get up in six hours, but you're like, damn, this 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 content's too hot to handle. Don't click on the next one. Roll over right now. And if you're watching this and you were using it as a tool to fall asleep, allow me to speak to you in your dreams. Who's a good boy? Who's a good boy? Sorry, I, I do this to my dog all the time. I don't really know what else to say except acting like you're a dog. <laughs> I don't. Sorry about that. <laughs> Never have uh -oh. One mana. One mana, 150 block. Good card, yes or no? Janet didn't pay attention to my ink bottle. I think I'm going to lose. Oh. Oh. Have the rest of my bits for the win. Always go believer. I'm new here? What the fuck? Okay. But are you new here from the YouTube channel? Or are you new here from like a recommended section or like another streamer or from just browsing? Because if it's not the YouTube channel, I'm so sorry. If it is the YouTube channel, are you really that surprised? <laughs> Valerie, they give the 76 months. Look at him! Subscribing. Fucking blasting! He's made friends with a cookie. There was a cookie trapped in the heart. There was a damsel trapped in th the heart. Had him trapped. He's gonna eat the cookie. No, I think he's gonna let the cookie dip in in his milk. It was sexual this entire fucking time. <laughs> Oh, Swargwar, thank you for the follow. Appreciate you, dude. Anybody who's new here and is, is dropping a follow, brand new sub, thinking about subbing? Listen, people is always like, dude, I can't afford a sub. I'm so sorry. Yeah, but you can think about it, though. Right? I'll know if you're thinking about subbing. I'll know. I can tell. I'm going to ponder subbing. Oh! Doing so much for me. It's doing so much for me right now. Lucas, thank you for giving this up to Envy. Oh, good God. Oh, good God. Are you guys ready for the stupid content now? Oh, fuck. I didn't record that. <laughs> don't worry. We don't need it for tomorrow. It's not necessary for me to have recorded that. Jay failed. Thank you for the five gifted. Mephisto, thank you for the two months. Oops. Fuck Andrew. No, I can upload it to the Dropbox tonight. I can, I, I, my, so like Twitch Leecher just like randomly stops working for people. And the guy who made Twitch Leecher no longer is supporting the application. So if it stops working for you ever, it'll just never work again. Um, and so I still can use it, but Andrew can't. So get fucked. Jay failed. Thank you for the five gifted subs. Making sure we're above 6,400 so we do fan games. That sucks for Andrew. Well, yeah, it just requires me. I got a leak. I, I upgraded my computer so I can, if I hit start recording, it records directly to the Dropbox now, but that requires me to do that. So feel free. If it's, if you ever show up in the beginning of the stream, ask me if I'm, if I'm recording, feel free for at least like the next couple of weeks. <clears throat> Wait, I got to do laundry, but what sucks for Andrew? Oh, I didn't record that. I didn't record that. You're just going to have to get the VOD yourself. But we have another video planned for tomorrow. We're uploading Bloons content. We're uploading the, the Bloons Impoppable win. My first ever Impoppable win. <clears throat> Can you become a Bloons YouTuber, please? Yeah, the void's kind of filled with, like, 
one major balloon YouTuber stopping and then another major balloon streamer getting canceled. So there is a void to fill in the balloons market, isn't there? There's a there's a there's a there's a major hole. Aliens Rock did give me my blessing yesterday. Yeah, he did. He did give me a blessing yesterday. <clears throat> Who stopped? Alien Rock, Scott, Alien Rock stopped playing it a while ago. But I don't know if anybody stepped in to fill that void. Bloon is perfect for you because it allows you to interact with chat between rounds. Yeah, I mean, it's very interactive. Um, yeah. It, but it's, it's whether or not... Uh, whether whether or not whenever I get a grasp on the game, if the backseating will go down. Right now, while I'm learning how to play the game, very, very welcome. Very, very, very welcomed. But I feel like it is an extremely easily uh, insert my opinion <laughs> type game. <laughs> it's not easy to parse if you join it in the middle. What? Bloons? Bloons is extremely easy to parse. There's balloons coming down the path, and my guys are going. <laughs> that's a that's a big lie. I don't know what the fuck went on yesterday. Oh, my bad then. Maybe it's because I understand balloons. Bloons is extremely satisfying. That's the thing. That's the thing about Bloons, right? Like, if you join in and it's your first time ever watching Super Auto Pets, do you understand what the fuck is going on? No. You don't. If you've never watched it before, you got no idea what the fuck's going on. But it's satisfying to watch, right? And that's what Super Auto Pets is really good at. That's what makes a good stream game. Because then you sit there and you watch the satisfying little things going on on the screen of like, bingus bongus, oh my god, why did you just fucking murder that ant with a pill? What the hell is that? <laughs> he euthanized an ant. <laughs> I think that's a waste of drugs. Um, you could have just stepped on it, but... Like, it's very satisfying, you know, bing, 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 things going back, numbers flying on screen. I think balloons is the same. Even if you don't understand, like, the conceptualization of balloons in the middle of a run because you haven't played a fuck ton of it, I think it's very satisfying to watch, and then you'll eventually start understanding it. You know what I'm saying? I like the part where you bought a spike factory. True. Did you do an SAP over explained? I think I tried a couple of times. Did it ever make it on YouTube? Thank you for subscribing. The mug wump. Think of the sure seven months. This recently, but will you go back to SAP with all of the new content they added? I want to give it another try. I've tried recently within like the last three weeks, and it was a lot. And it's like very technical now. And it like it felt like it was like I was like, wait, am I just playing TFT with emojis now? Like, for a while, it was just, like, a, a goofy little auto-battler. But now it just feels like, because since they're trying to add so much new stuff, that it's, like, hyper-technical now. Which isn't necessarily a bad thing. I just got, like, a little shocked by it at first. You know what I'm saying? Lucky strike. First time chatter. What's going on, dude? <laughs> technical how? There's just a lot of different keywords that all have, like, that don't make sense until you've, like, tried them 100 billion times. Hold on, Chad. I'm updating the title of the stream. Can you please check the title of the stream and <laughs> tell me whether you like the title of the stream? <laughs> Can you please peep at the title of the stream? <laughs> oh man oh man <laughs> that 
That one guy's lost respect for me. I just opened up my League of Legends client. Oh no! Do do boop do do do. All right, chat, here's the deal. Here's the deal. Imagine this is the thing that gets you kicked out of the League Partner program. I have literally said publicly on Twitter that I would go against explicit rules stated in the League Partner program. It is explicitly stated in the LPP to not give your codes to another non-LPP content creator to give out to their fans as if they were LPP. You cannot do that. And I said publicly on Twitter that I was going to give Nicky Boy my codes so that he could give them out. So that he could then say, yo, guys, I've like been getting these codes every month. But like for whatever reason, I got, it doesn't look like I'm a part of the LPP. Could I like get back in so that like I could, you know, continue being a part of the thing? And then Chibin then responded with, yo, I think that's against the rules. And then Riot Swim Bananas responded, the head of the league partner program. She's the head of it. She runs the show. She does the thing. She, she does the thing. She responded to me with eyeball emojis. She knows. And I didn't get kicked out. So. <laughs> I don't know what will. <laughs> like, I, I don't know what will at this point. I'll be honest. I really don't know what will. I, I don't know. I don't know. Would you go to Pornhub to get out of the program? I think going to Pornhub would just get me banned on Twitch. That's not going to get me out of the League Partner program. <laughs> what time do we stop stalling? Bro, I'm just trans... I'm transitioning between games. I'm, I'm taking a five-minute breather to talk to my chat. I've already played. I've been playing games for the last two hours. I take a break for five minutes. Tristan, where's the music? Where's the music, Tristan? I got you. Don't worry. I'm so sorry. Sorry. Where's the... Sorry. I got it. Don't worry. I'm going to... I'm going to make sure that you guys are all... Don't worry. I don't want you guys to feel like there's no music in the background of the stream right now while I'm doing a small not talking portion of the stream. I don't want you to do that. I'm here for the League Games Lego. <laughs> Thank you for Decent remix. <laughs> you know, I could see this. Yo, Covetus Cat, thank you so much. Yeah, you are legally required to start a hype train if it is possible. I don't know if it's possible, actually. I don't know if hype train's on cooldown or not. But you are legally required to fucking try to start one if it's possible. Look at that. There it is. Imagine not liking stall. Be soft cringe or so the mind. I'm, I'm just memeing. Server has listen, been listen, listen. On. I don't even remember who said it. If it was you, I, I'm not actually mad at all. I'm just, I'm memeing. What are you going to change your I, name to this time? What is it right now? Oh my god, it's Joe Biden's flute. <laughs> hey, you're the brand new Prime sub. Lucky Strike. Yakukona, thank you. I'm in the League Partner Program, guys. This is my main League of Legends account that is a, that is in Riot's database as an unlocked League of Legends account. I don't know if it still is. Maybe they took it away. Nope, it's not. This is an unlocked League of Legends account by Riot Games. I have 100% of the champions. I have 100% of the skins. Go to the match history. When was the last time I played? It was probably offline with, with ELO. 1119. Yeah, I was playing with ELO offline. The amount of money that sucks you have gotten this month is crazy. Yeah. 
I'm just going to turn up the music and not think about it. Cut off. Thank you for the eight months. AV, thank you for the 46 months. Jared, thank you for the six months. Thank you for subscribing. Dude, I still got it though, man. Be able to not play for as many months and I as I do and then just still win. Still got a couple of these were these were on stream games. These were on stream games. And then I played with Elo. Peggy's on screen falling wall, so hey, that's me splooge. Uh-huh. Level nine hype train. I didn't think a hype train would beat the one from earlier today, but look at Look at Guy of Metal coming in, slamming Tignal up against the wall. What's that meme of the, the, the I, I believe, lesbian couple where there's the one very large woman picking up the smaller one and pushing her up against the wall? Dude, <laughs> that's porn. <laughs> Their clothes are enough at the time. Their clothes are enough at the time. Is, is, is fully clothed at the moment. That's not just a meme. That's not a meme that's porn. Well, okay, would you say that the milk emote in our chat is not a meme, that it's just porn? Because if so, every time you type milk in my chat, you're just posting porn. You're just posting porn. That's all you're doing. It's not, you're not posting a funny meme. Because that, that woman in that, in that, in that gif, she doesn't have clothes on. And if you, if you were to expand that image to see the rest of it, she has a collar around her and no clothes on. And there's a guy with a rock hard dick behind her. Telling her what to do. And in the moment it is to drink the milk. <laughs> hey, thank you for the two months. It is a hundred percent a meme. Yeah, for the fact that there's the the Leona Diana version of that, the fact that those that the that the different versions of that meme exists already tells you that it's a legitimate. It is a meme. So we count those hundred subs. <laughs> hey guy of metal were you wanting to count those hundred subs towards um if i lose i have to match those hundred subs is that what you were or were you just gifting it out of the kindness of your heart yes you were okay um so i was originally gonna play a custom game <sighs> fuck me but like i feel like if i play a custom game my team's just gonna throw that's not fun I'm only going to play a custom game if you guys promise to try. You, I refuse to throw. All right, get Prado on my team. Hold on. Uh, we'll do draft pick. You mean the meme where Lauren Phillips holds Alice Marchesi against the wall? <laughs> hmm. King Dingleberry. Okay, I don't know. Whoops, I added a bot. I don't know if I can trust that that means that you're going to try. I don't know if I can, that means I can trust that, but please. Okay. I need only, I need the greatest gamers on my team. I need to stack my team. I only need people that will try right now. Brawler is cool. Brawler, you are the OG. Get on my team. Okay. And the rest of the players, you may join at random. The password is cummies, spelled C-U-M-M-I-E-S. Password is cummies. Feel free to join the game. I am playing mid lane, by the way. <clears throat> what? Diamond, di get the diamond three player on my team. Oh, no. Oh, no. Why is there a, there's a diamond three player on the enemy team? There's a diamond three player. Uh, Blarlem, are you by chance a sub? Could you sp speak in chat or forever hold your peace? Could you say in this League of Legends chat who uh, who is uh, who you are in in Twitch chat?
<clears throat> I am scared. I am scared. This is uh. It says diamond because I'm diamond in TFT. Oh, that's just armadillo. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay, it's just they're just they're just diamond. They're just diamond in TFT. That's it. They're just diamond in TFT. It's fine. It's fine. It's okay. Okay, this is fine. That's fine. Saved. Saved. All right, let's start the game. All right, I am mid laner. I am mid laner. Who do I ban these days? Who do I ban these days? Ooh. Ooh. You ban a soul? Yeah, I don't know what the new a soul does, so I guess I'll ban him. A soul's so fat right now. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> Kind of gross. Who should I play? Like, what should those who know my champions? Who's the best right now? Is Yumi broken too? I know that Yumi just got reworked. Yeah, we can ban her. <clears throat> I gotta, dude. I gotta remember all my buttons. Like, I legitimately don't even remember like what buttons to press. This is going to be muscle memory at this point, man. All right, last champion to ban. Last champion to ban. Victor Jungle got buffed. <laughs> um, Shen mid is actually OP. I can deal with Shen mid. You know what? I'm going to ban Yone because I don't like him. I just don't like him. Hey, Jimmy V. Just not a fan. Does anybody on my team want me to pick for them? So I don't get blasted. I'll do Zack jungle. Can I pick for you, brawler? Okay. What is this? Rune recommendations? Ew, gross. Against a Yasuo. I can beat Yasuo. I can beat Yasuo. I can actually, I can actually like destroy Yasuo. There's like not even a chance. There's like not even a chance. There is like there is zero percent chance. I'll destroy you, Suo. Give me give me Oriana. Give me Oriana right now. Give me Oriana. I'll destroy you, Suo. Absolutely, I will destroy them. Uh definitely want ultimate hunter. Could go cheap shot. Could go eyeball collection instead. Attack speed I prefer. I have no idea what any of these buttons mean. These are just like your small power-ups that you can decide for. Um, yeah. Hey, you guys like my rune names? I have Fartbox, Fartbox Simulator, Big Poo Hole with an emoji, Big Shen. Hi, this was a username in my chat. Big Ramen, Big Butthole Poop, Big Big Butthole, Poopy Butthole. You guys like my runes? How many games do I plan on playing? Well, currently, if I lose this game, I have to gift 100 subs. Or 105. It's however many gifted. I think it's 105 right now. Um, so, if I if I lose this one, I'd be going to spend the day offline, you know? <laughs> oh, no. What's my average rank? High plat, low diamond. Uh, average rank in the game? I don't know. My average rank, though, over the years. High plat, low diamond.
Staples, thank you for the 56. Thank you for subscribing. Who the fuck is this? That's how you're going to lose against me. Or win against, <laughs> against me. Is going to play the champions that I don't fucking know. What new skins has Oriana gotten? Or Biana. Go gross. <laughs> I don't like that. He's a melee 80 carry. Oh, is she the one with the whip? She got the whip. Jason R. Cross, thank you for the 10. I just finished watching today's YouTube video and I like supporting small streamers, so this money is for Left <laughs> Frost. <laughs> Thanks. Thanks. Why does every single time I go live, people just spell cum? It's literally every single time. What is that, dude? What game is this? Is it new? Never seen you play this on YouTube. What the hell is going on? What the hell is going? Am I going to load in? Okay, I'm loading in. Never seen you play this on YouTube? Don't go to my YouTube channel and order it by most popular videos. Don't do that. We need to put it on borderless. Please don't fuck up everything. Oh, oh, oh. Are we good? Everything look good on screen? Oh yeah, I need to turn one thing off. I actually need to turn off my synergy. I need to turn off my synergy. Sorry, don't ghost me. Don't kill me. My synergy is off. My synergy allows me to go to my other computer. So you can have, uh, you can use one mouse and keyboard on two different computers on off of a local server that's, you know, housed on your, on one of your computers. Um, and if I double tap on the, this side of my monitor, it goes to my other computer, no matter what program I'm in, no matter, no matter what I'm doing. And so if I'm ever doing this, sometimes I'll just lose my mouse onto my other fucking computer. And that's not a good thing. So it's a really handy program to be able to declutter your desk. The music is really loud, by the way. Wait, my music's really loud? It doesn't sound that loud to me. Is it really loud? It's, it seems like it's normal volume. I don't hear music at all. All right, who is, wait, is this Armadillo T playing on EU Ping? Lamau, get, get ready to give, you would be a Yasuo main. All right, I'm to own. I'm to frick you up. Get set to get fricked, man. Get set to get fricked! <laughs> Is he saying this guy's name wrong on purpose? Armadillo T? I'm getting ganked. Yo, stupid jungler, stop taking my XP. <laughs> I'm a true League of Legends player, aren't I? I said mean things to my jungler. Am I a League of Legends player? Am I one of the cool guys? I missed the cannon! see minus one apparently there's a dude in your jungle mm, top lanes feeding one in chat if I should ban them in in in, in twitch chat find out who they are Mm, they're feeding. They did say that they were smurfing top earlier. Because it's not about the feeding. It's about the lying. 
I'm just, I'm being a goofball. Am I being a bit of a goofball? Sorry about that. Am I goofing too much? Do I need to stop? What's the best items to build right now? I actually don't know what to build. That's the one thing I can't keep up with is items. I can keep up with what champions are strong. Roa? Is that real? Nasher's Tooth? What? I missed the cannon for this. We better kill him. And it better be me that gets the kill. Boom! All right, Brawler, if, if you get me to 10 kills this game, I'll remod you. Thank you for subscribing. Bet. <laughs> I don't think it's Roa, man. Seth, thank you for the 21. Really? What is the recommended? What is it? What does it recommend? Epic. Roa plus AP tier. It's arm guard. And no, I don't think I need to go arm guard right now. Top tab. Mage. Go to the recommended tab. Yeah, they say Ludens, dude. I gotta get back to lane. I'm wasting time. Song me. Oh. That did like a throwback of League of Legends and Hades. Hades music in the background. That's what I used to play every day. Because there's super long songs that are just fantastic hyped up background songs. First canon of the game acquired. Only took him six minutes. He's incredible. Let him cook. Toxicity. Thank you for the 13 months. Throwing your balls in people's face. Oh, yeah, baby. Yeah, walk up to that creep. I dare you. See what happens. You're going to get fucking blasted. Yeah, walk up again. Do it. Who's their jungler, by the way? Kane? I know what Kane does. It fucking blasted. An ally has been slain. Owned? Have I died yet? <laughs> I'm not just gonna die, man. I'm not that bad. I'm not bad at the game. Double ward bot An side. Check this out. Hey, should I go bot? There's like a chance I should, actually. No, I don't think so. Are you gonna try to bully me out of lane? Tisk tisk, little armadillo. End his life. Okay, because it's Jesus. <laughs> feel like I'm in like the middle of a gladiator ring right now. Oh my god, I'm gonna get ulted. Blocked! Yeah, don't tell Armadillo that he's getting ganked. What server am I playing on? Well, seeing as I live in North America, Russia. So, like the streamer in League of Legends, we buy your items. I used to do that. Not like, you know, you would intend for me to want to lose, but I used to would do like whatever stupid builds chat would give me money for. I've always been a sellout, man. Things haven't changed. How did you initially get into League of Legends? My brother was playing it. I didn't even have a computer and he had a laptop and he was playing Vayne. And he was tumbling around. I was like, that looks sick. Q 
Q-tip. I do feel bad for Armadillo because he's gotten zero ganks. He's gotten zero ganks. Q-tip, they give it the six. I appreciate the fuck out of you. Just comparative number of ganks. Their jungler might be doing really well. He's currently 1-0-1. One, one. He's not doing poorly. He's just not focusing on his side of the map, and it sucks to be on that losing end, you know? <gasps> he actually might get the kill here. If you want it, you gotta come get it, big man. Trade one for one. Actually, no. I think I'm gonna go these. For operating on muscle memory, you're doing pretty good. Thanks, man. What the hell is this? I get to decide whether to take... Oh, I need to move my camera a little bit. Oh, wait. I have to use this now. Put myself down. Tier? Why do I need a tier? Why does everybody say build a tier? What is this like an OPS item now? Is this like actually insanely good? Yeah? Right. I'm believing you. Seraph just wasn't that good back in the day. Tier is super good now. What got buffed about it? Like what's so good? Health damage CDR mana shield. Mana shield? Wait, no, but that's Seraphs, right? That's just what Seraph does. Seraphs has always done that. Right? Does it give me CDR like every other item in the game? Should I have been roaming here and I'm not paying attention? So I'm reading Twitch chat because they're so cute. Need blue trinkets. I don't know what you do. I'm scared. My kill, not yours. Ban MF. Ban MF for flashing for that. Why would you do that? Why would you do that, MF? Why would you flash for that? I'm pogging out of my damn mind. I'm telling you, dude. I got the balls. I got the skills. God, that attack speed room feels so good. Ping her flash. <laughs> nah, that's cool, man. I'm just jazzed. I, uh, listen, listen. I'm not an actual Toxic League player. I'm like legitimately, I'm legitimately speaking, I'm not a Toxic League player. Don't say Copium. If you haven't seen me play League, I'm, an, I'm, I'm not a Toxic League player. This is all in jest. I don't actually care if you take my kills, if you take all of my farm. You're not getting me. But I'll stay around to BM a little bit. <gasps> I love that when you wind wall my ball, it still goes through the wind wall, but it forces it to stop wherever it is. So, like, I can still then move it afterwards. Like, if it's after the two-second cooldown, I can just continue to move it forward. I think that's a little bit strong. Like, maybe shouldn't work like that. Ooh, that was a good wind wall, actually. That was a really... Oh, what the hell? That was a really good wind wall. Ooh, get stuffed. Nice, nice. I gotta get my ult off. Oh, so close. Wait, nice fucking gang. That was really good. They probably pinged that and I didn't pay attention. Typical mid laner. <laughs> Are you still a member of the League Partner Program? Yeah. This guy. Whose name on Twit on League that is in the League of Legends Riot Games database is Joe Biden's Splooge. <laughs> Maybe I could have done that with Flash. No.
Didn't ping 50 times. Yeah, I know. Wait, this is, this is a good kill, good kill, good kill. Oh my god, he lets me have it. I think you've gotten me, what, four out of my six kills? Maybe three, three out of my six? Keeping track. With that mod. Armadillo almost got that tower. It's like as good as gone. Oh, you can go that far away off that ulti? What the hell? Was that because I flashed at the same time? Maybe I should have considered going Leandris. But I guess it is blue cane. So I'm not super worried about that. Thank you for subscribing. Mid laner is best laner. Ay, 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 under assassin. Thank you, baby. Appreciate you. Yeah, Leandris would be good against Orn, but... Other than that, it's not that necessary, I guess. Dude! Riven! Oh, wait. I thought you I thought your score was 60. Sorry, I'm not BMing. I'm not BMing. I thought, I thought you were scored. I'm the Peglin man. Hello, Peglin enjoyer. <laughs> I'm sorry that I'm not playing Peglin right now. But I hope that you can just enjoy me as a fellow Peglin enjoyer. Is this Dan stream? There's such BM here. Ben Briggs me. I'm going to pop off to Ben Briggs. I know we've listened to Ben Briggs at least like 17 times today, but it doesn't matter. There's never enough Ben that you can have in your life. Yeah, 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 yeah. Where's my ball? Nice, nice, nice. Almost got my Archangel. Is there going to be Splunk at the end of the stream or has YouTube uh, broken my sense of time? YouTube has broken your sense of time. The, if you're watching the VOD channels, the VOD channels are a week out. They're a week behind at this point. Here we go. I'm, uh, I, you know, I would consider doing a little long key at the end of the stream today. But today is supposed to be like 70 degrees outside and tomorrow is supposed to be snowing, so. <laughs> Don't mind me going on a bike ride today in like, probably like an hour and a half. Song name, uh, Flying Battery Zone, Ben Briggs. Let's go, baby. I think I think we're chasing too hard. Prime <laughs> no way, is that him? There's no way. Holy, it must be him. Didion. How's it going, dude?
Do 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 Okay, I definitely need some tank busting for Orin. What can I get for that? Just raw damage and then just don't care about him? Probably, yeah. <laughs> just like raw damage and then don't, don't care that he exists. Yeah, that's probably the play. Yeah, a little Void Staff. A little Void staff -ticity. I'm with you, I'm with you. In giga ganks right now, man. Okay, so I said I wasn't going to worry about him, and then I did like all of my damage to him. Oh, like we're losing hard in this game. I didn't even realize that. I'm doing really well, though. I'm really fucking strong though. Hear me out, chat. Um, should I go for the ballsy play? One's in chat if I should go for the ballsy play. Do it, cute balls. <laughs> Holy, this guy's balls. The fact that it is Earth Drake, too, does kind of suck because of this how strong this fucking Orn is. Oh, I'm just fucking gone. Jesus Christ. That felt like. What the hell? MF's kind of shredding him, though. What the hell? That felt a little bit fucked up. Plus 100 subs. And where the hell did that cane come from? Damn. Why the hell is the cane here? What is that? Like, he came from this way. It just felt weird for him to be over there when they wanted to be a dragon. Felt weird. Felt goofy, indeed. We got this, though. Kane falls off hard. Go, Ribbons. Get you back in the game, baby. Oh, Kane's recalling. I can get blue. <laughs> Why the hell is Kane? Kane falls off hard, dude. Blue Kane does, man. At least back in the day, he did. Unless he's changed now. Does Blue Kane not fall off hard? Of a mid lane. Yeah, yeah. Different spots do different things, but that's about it. Yeah, mid lane is all about control. Being a mage and being able to control the center of the map. Because you see how this lane is so long. 
there's so there's such a long length of lack of vision but here when you lose this middle tower you're getting cut off from so much of the map because of the vision loss that you're getting so it's really really important to maintain that control in the mid lane and have that short lane um, and your 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 role is to also make sure that you're helping out all all of the sides as well because it's so easy for you to get around. Yeah, and because you're in that solo lane, you're gaining a hell of a lot of XP. Yeah. Maybe we could have fought that. I wanted to get away from the Ornalts. My bad, my bad. We might have been able to fight that. It's my bad. That's my bad. Damn, almost dodged that. Almost dodged there. Could I ask a real dumb question? Vagina penis. That's something of a dumb question. Oh my god, this Slay the Spire update's looking crazy. Oh my god. Didn't see that one coming. How do I get the funny cat yes, yes, and no emotes? 7TV, it's a browser extension. I hope you today... Yo, what up, Diego? What up, man? What up? Mm -mm. Jump on his ass! GG boys. What the hell? GG man. <clears throat> GG. I tried my best, but I couldn't succeed. Can somebody tell me what happened? Uh, I won. Nobody else on my team did. Feels bad, man. Zach camped mid and nowhere else. I don't think that's true. He successfully ganked mid more often than other lanes, it does seem, but... I don't think he went nowhere else than mid. AP Blitz would have carried this? Actually true. I've got big power spike. Let me go grab my power spike real quick. Don't die while I'm gone, everybody. 
Yeah, Camping Mid is also not a bad option. Oh, well. I didn't get to play in that last fight. <clears throat> Hundred and five subs. Ugh. You saw that shield down? Oh, yeah. Hundred and five motherfucking subs. Double or nothing? No. <laughs> uh no. Call that one a warm up? Dude, I think I did amazing. I think I did A-OK -okay that game. MF's damage was crazy. She just couldn't get any last hits. Yeah, I did pretty fucking good, man. I think I did pretty good. Hope you and Han have a good day outside. I have to give the 105 fucking subs. 105 subs, really? Really? For that? For that game? Feels bad, man. Boo 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 doo boo doo boo doo boo. I'll give 10 if you do another game. Nah, if, if I do another game, I have to give them back. We'll do one more. I'll do one more. It's a feels bad, man, because of the fucking 100 subs. And I felt like I played great. I felt like I was smoothing, man. I felt like I was fucking going hard. Was I not? Oh my god, Frost Prime is your biggest fan? Wait, where is Frost Prime? Frost Prime is on my is on my friends list somewhere. Thank you for subscribing. I do have the real trick. Frost Prime on my friends list. Oh my god, is that Frost Prime? <laughs> All right. <clears throat> Holy shit, is that Frost Prime? All right. Chat password to this game is poo poo, all one word. Poo poo, all one word. If you played in last game, don't join this one. If we see any duplicates, I'm kicking you out. If you played in last one, don't play in this one. All right, Chad, do you see any duplicates? That's me. Just making sure. I just want to make sure that there's no duplicates. No? Okay. Cool, cool, cool. <sighs> One more game. And I will respect. I will match all of the gifted subs that happen. All right. Who did I hate from last game? Orn. <laughs> uh, dude, Kane wasn't that bad. Like, of course, Kane does like a thousand fucking damage, but like he wasn't bad. Kane, Kane was not a, 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 like he was not difficult to deal with, you know, as a champion, not as a player. It was literally all Orn. Orn is a was a fucking menace. So ban the shit out of that guy. What's wrong with Orn? Says the guy who literally just played Orn. <laughs> You know.
Did Orn do anything? Yeah, he's a f he's just he's a he's a wall that you just can't get get through. He was Orn was the only reason that they won that game, like definitively. Obviously, everybody else on their team played fantastically. They played wonderfully. But if you take Orn out of that equation, we had a ch we had a shot. You know what I'm saying? You replace Orn with like insert squishier top laner. We had a shot. Genuinely. He stood there menacingly. <laughs> I'm banning Yone again now. Orn was the only one Frost could have one shot. Yeah, dope him. <laughs> All right. Um, final ban. Chat tells <laughs> tells me the cat is broken as ever, so I'll give them the ban. Ugh. Oh, you're such a big, strong gamer. You leaked that legend so good. Now give me some sugar. I mean, okay. <laughs> All right, you want to see the true gamer come out, though? Is Echo still a good character? Is he still good? Yeah, he's not bad. More of a jungler? I don't give a shit. How about you jungle one of these? You know what I'm saying? No, I think I'm still going to run this. Go Absolution. Meow. Did you pick Ding Dong into me? Hyper Digger players are unfun and uncool and lame and stupid. How's my opinion? Are they good? Take those 20 bucks now. I'm going broke today, man. You inspired me to play Spelunky 2, and I made some of my most successful shorts from it. <laughs> Tanks, bro. Oh, man. Can you play the fish guy that eats people? Tom Kench? I do like a Tom Kench. Tom Kench is a cutie. Who do you play without using their names? Um, I play the tentacle monster. I play the ball character that's cool and not the one that wants power. Um, I play the time guy and also the other time guy <laughs> in case there's any confusion. Um, There's three time guys? Wait, who's the third? Echo Zillion and... I seem to have dodged all of your gifted subs. Is this a problem with Twitch? <laughs> New champion named Balls Guy. Oh, who's Balls Guy? All right. Don't forget, I am, I am, I am uh, matching gifted subs this game. So if I lose, if if I lose, I will have to match any gifted subs. I don't think it can get any worse than last game though. So I think I'll be fine. I'm still going Doran's. Eat shit. I respect nothing of Heimerdinger. I do not respect Heimerdinger. It could be a Heimerdinger support, actually, because he's got heal. Is that a Ding Dong support, you think? Well, no, because they got Dark Harvest, and that's always... That's always supporty. 
Wait, is that Shaker mid? Wait, what the hell? What? Wait, what the hell? Where are people Holy going? Holy shit, Frost playing League of Legends, just like old times. Get it, because you're playing Echo. Have a wonderful day, Mr. Streamer. Koopas! Running man, thank you the five gifted. Didion, are you just a boss watcher? Because you play Scion in Alawi exactly? The surprise Koopas is always the best. I think this might actually be Lux Myth. And then it's Ding Dong Shaco Bot. Wait, that's actually kind of cool. That Lux was just right here. Hello! It's great to see you! Uh, how do I do those? How do, how do you do those again? How do you... I don't know how to do emotes. Yo, did someone just get 4,200 bits? Here's something bits? won't have give back hello, Yo, and I sick. wish that's could awesome. play yeah, with, so but I'm IT cool. Genie. Um... I'm Yo, like here to grab like one wish, yeah, yeah. like whatever you want. So okay. whenever you're ready, just go ahead and give it. Take your I wish that I get another 100 subs this game, but then hear me out. I win the game. <gasps> Wait, hold on. Let him cook. Can I do that? Yeah, yeah. That's that's pretty, should be pretty easy. Yeah, I got you, man. All right, so, sick, dude. All right, I got to get out of here. Uh, Chat, look at him, pay attention, see where he goes. See where he goes. Dude, where the fuck does he go? The, there's no way that he actually does magic, right? He just fucking disappears into the the smoke. I I don't get it. Like maybe he like gets us on drugs so that we don't see where he goes. You know? You think so? It's like the only logical solution in my head. What a weird game this is. This is an interesting one. Also, it's Shaco support Ding Dong ADC. Not going to miss the cannon. He's not going to miss the cannon. Ooh, copium. Koopas. I, I got hit. I dare you to step in that. Maybe. I wouldn't have, I wouldn't have done it. Oh, you're stunning me like fucking crazy. Have fun with your Dark Harvest. That's nice. Good for you. And I have a Dark Harvest in... Like, can you walk under my tower right now and just give me a Dark Harvest to even it out? I won't kill you. I just want Dark Harvest. Oh. This luck's kind of good, man. A formidable opponent. Almost out of mana, though. <laughs> Insert Tyler 1 meme clip against E Riot Freak. Yeah, what's better than Dark Harvest 1? Wait, this is just like last game, except the roles are reversed and my team's doing incredible. Is uh is Protobot still really good on this guy? Shut down. An enemy has been slain. I don't like it, but yeah. <laughs> Dead down to the bot lane in a 1v2 situation, but it's actually just Thresh left alone. They're going to be feared out. Oh my god, it's so scary. It's Shaco. All right, give me a good song to break it down to real quick. Hold up. Let this guy break it down. 
Yeah, I've heard that Roa is like OP as shit now. I've missed the shout casting. All right, I'll, I'll get you some shout casting this game. I actually didn't cast at all last game. Will you say how Oplog used to be? True throwback. <clears throat> how did I used to intro to it though? Was Echo always a whiny bitch, always stuck in the past? Or is he actually really, really strong and one of the best characters in the game and needs to be nerfed to all heck and back? Find out on today's episode of How OP League Used to Be. Is that good? Ooh, that could have been like a giga hook. Holy. Oh, that's how you emote. Okay, I figured it out. That I figured out how to emote. Let me cook. That's your that's the ability that you have maxed. So like I don't really have to be scared of you after that, right? Holy Thresh is back. The hook of the gods. And I'm getting my ass camped. By this cute Thresh player. You think I won't go in on that? Love the YouTube kind of a huge lurker during the work day. Much love, dude. Welcome back. Holy. Finally beat Crucible 14 after strike. Dude, I just wanted the Dark Harvest, man! Give me the Dark Harvest! Here's some bits to celebrate. Oh, thanks. Thought I could get in range. I still. This is embarrassing. Wizard Staff, you distracted me. This is all your fault. Never mind, Zed's got him. Zed's got him. That's like I planned. That's actually what I planned on it happening there. That's actually what I that's actually what I planned on happening there. So good job, Zed. And like we discussed. This is a good timeline. Thank you for the one thousand, dude. <clears throat> good shit on your uh, on your crucible dub. On your crucible dub. Alright, one's in chat if you think I'm gonna win this game. I did get the Dark Harvest stack, so. All is right in the world. Thresh is here. Does he get the cook? This is the third time for sure. He goes for the flay originally. Frost Prime goes in with a little bit of the time work tonic. Gets the big slam. Dodges on the Q. Goes back in for the Dark Harvest. He gets it. It's coming back in. A beautiful play by him and Thresh with the Ignite to kill. Easy. Kha'Zix in the enemy jungle. Grabs a kill on Thresh as he's roaming back to lane. But here comes Zed in order to take him down. Sees the Shaco box with the red trigger. Jumps over it with the moving shadow. But look, he might be a little bit overextended. He ends up probably going down here to Scry Clown. Cross Prime remembering that there is that thing in the bush. He comes in, gets the stun down, grabs one kill. Shaco poofs off into the nether realm. Probably going to walk up here towards his teammate, a.k.a. the Kha'Zix. Kha'Zix over the wall. Frost Prime really wants it here. Goes into the bush. Not going to find it. Where did Kha'Zix go? Could be anywhere on the map. Shaco under the tower. Mm -hmm. Hey, bud. 
You think I won't go in on this? We need like 10% more passion. I, I'm better when, when I don't... Dude, thrash buddy. Like, I feel bad. Dude, give me the fucking Dark Harvest stack. Okay, we killed you. Did I get the stack? Wait, did I get the stack? Did you just keep timing these barriers perfectly for me to not get the stack? I think I got it. I'm like pretty sure I got it. I don't want to stay here and get Kha'Zix. An enemy has been slain. I did get it. Sick. I go CDR boots. <laughs> I'm not gonna do that. I think I got it because of the kill. I don't know. I heard the Dark Harvest sound. Maybe it was her getting one though. I feel like Frost is just an actual shoutcaster. I had a shot at becoming a shoutcaster. Dude, this Lux doesn't deserve this, man. Seriously. Let's be nice. <laughs> this Lux doesn't deserve this. Lux, run. <laughs> Get out of there, Lux. Here, you 1v1 that guy. I'll stay over here. If you win, you win. Hey, Kha'Zix. I may have overextended here. The answer to that question would be potentially very much yes. Golf clap and chat to Kha'Zix. Straight up. <laughs> I appreciate you. <laughs> Dead sacrificed himself for you? I don't know. I think Kha'Zix had kind of given up the chase, but... I figured out how to do the emotes. Do you like this one? It's a Poro. Ooh, good one. That was sick. Sorry, Lux. Okay, good flash, good flash. I hope you're having fun. Since 100 subs isn't on the line, I'm having more fun. Regardless of the score of the game. Last game just got a little bit dicey since I had 105 subs that I had the gift for losing. Just look out. You have a ghost following your every move. <laughs> Thanks. Keep that in mind. That was fucking terrifying. Night Red Eyes, thank you for the 31 when months. Did you start to play on stream again? Also, Today. Hello, happy 31st. Today's probably the only day I'm going to play it too. It's, good. it's a good nostalgic throwback to play League every now and then on stream. 
but it definitely is something that needs to stick around, you know? There's plenty of other League content creators out there that are doing better shit than I ever could, you know? At this stage of my career. Damn. You walked away from that beautifully. That was actually really well done by you. Damn. Kha'Zix is cooking, man. Kha'Zix is cooking. Why is that a shutdown? Huh? Why is that a shutdown? Why did I have a bounty? Excuse me? Because of my farm? I have 30. I have a 30 CS lead. Hunt, did you just put a question mark in the chat? Is Hunt a little toxic little freak? Is Hunt a toxic little freak? Wait, you're listening to the stream too? A ghosting toxic little freak. Could you imagine? Wipe him out, dude. I gotta remember how to use this proto belt thing, man. I don't watch. You're listening! If I say, yo, I'm gonna go bot lane right now and kill Heimerdinger, what are you gonna do to react to that? Huh? What are you gonna do? Anybody, whenever they're whenever I see ghosters on on like big streamer streams, and like I'm not watching, I'm just listening. It's like, alright, I guess I'm just playing with no fucking sound on I'm just not I just can't say a damn word if I say one thing I incriminate myself and my entire team <laughs> I don't want to still be mid man too many goobers are here right now I just want the Dark Harvest stack. Just give me the Dark Harvest stack. I missed the jump. Come on, Bob. Those those are playing Slay Spire. Refresh the stream. No, but I think you are just as shitty of a ghoster if you are just listening to the stream. All right, I'll shut it off. Thank you. Someone's streaming? Wait, who's the streamer in the lobby? <laughs> There's a streamer in the lobby, guys. Oh, shit, I'm getting fucked up. I'm getting hunted down by this Kazi. Can't blame him, though. I am the, you know the cutest player on this entire team <laughs> i can't blame him man they i you know out of all of the players on my team like who would you go for you know <laughs> oh man what the hell did you see that what the hell just happened on my screen caitlin kind of cooking though here comes a Lowey Titty and grabs the soul right out of him. Starts smacking on it, but they're just going to walk out of range. Scion here pushing the Shaco turret back into him. Gay gaming might have something to cook here. Let them cook. Lowey walking forward, dealing big damage on the gay gaming. Net and out goes out to Caitlyn. Wait, that was the fake clown? Oh my god. What the hell? Didn't see that one coming, man. Legendary. That guy stayed invisible forever. 
Did they buff that? It's okay. I just got to support my fed carry. Support this. Oh. I'm bad. Look at me. I'm on my hoverboard like odd in Code Lyoko. What the hell? Apocalypse Frost is playing League. Yeah. Have you guys kept track? I think it's, uh, I think we're up to at least like 15 jokes made about the fact that I'm playing League. Every time, man. Every time. All right. I'm going to ward up against the Kha'Zix. That means I won't die to it, right? See you, man. Chad, I got a Dark Harvest stack. Let's fucking go. <laughs> Honestly deserved. Had to stay quiet because I didn't know if he was still listening. I couldn't say, let's see if we can gank this Heimerdinger at bottom lane. I got the, I got the Dark Harvest stack. It's all good. It's all fucking worth it, baby. I'm running. I'm running. I'm really fast. I'm running extremely fast in the opposite direction. Give it to give it to Shaco. Give it to Shaco. That's the play. I'm up to eight stacks of DH. DH stacks up. Big stonks. What are other what are other fun gamer words? Frost is feeding again. I didn't even feed last game. What do you mean again? What do you mean again? Since November when the last time I played? He's feeding since November. Last game I was like eight and two, but my team was like one in eighteen. An ally has been slain. Did you have zero deaths last game? True, my bad. You caught me. Guys, I got this. Frost, chill. <laughs> Guys, get behind me. Boom, 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 boom. I almost pressed three to try to use one of my potions. Uh oh. <laughs> this is embarrassing. I think Kazakh is over here. This is going to be a bad time. Holy shit, that was so well placed. That's ridiculous, dude. That was a ridiculously well placed Shackle Box. Unbelievable.
What the hell, man? He's fading again, man! Oh, what the hell? Yeah, you can get Dark Harbor stacks off Faco. Yeah. Kha'Zix just has it out for you. I'm the streamer. When you're the when you're the streamer in the game, you always get sweat for it. You can get upset over that, or you can just understand that it's gonna happen. I'll only get upset if I know that my viewers are ghosting. So if we gift a hundred more mid-game, yes, it does technically count. Yes, yes, it does. What are, what are you trying to say? Right now it's five. It's five. You goofing? Being a little bit of a goofy goober over there. I haven't yet to have like a good alt on this guy. Dude, honestly, gay gaming popping off this game. Thank you for subscribing. I give Prime Sub in hopes to add more. <laughs> Thank you, boy. Appreciate you, baby. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Ooh. Rampage. I didn't get the Dark Harvest, man. Oh. Kazakh, is he alive? Kazakh is heading towards my direction very quickly. See? <laughs> See? Kha'Zix is rapidly... If, if Kha'Zix is alive and you are visible on the map, Kha'Zix is rapidly approaching your location. You know what? No, I think I go Red Trinket. <clears throat> I thought that was Warwick. No, I just mean this Kha'Zix. <laughs> I just mean this guy. Not any Kha'Zix. Just this guy. This guy's got my number. You know? My number is... Sorry, I have my anti-doxing feature on it. Auto mutes anytime. I try to set my phone number. Read his lips. It's okay. My dad reads lips all the time, but he would always say that I would mumble. And I was like, Dad, you, you're hard of hearing. And he's like, Yeah, you were mumbling. I couldn't read your lips. <laughs> he told me I was bad at enunciating with my mouth. So, I had to work on that. I got better, though. I got better. Give me the damn Dark Harvest stacks, man! What the hell, dude? Oh, Kha'Zix is in my ass. Stay on me! Stay on me! Stay on me! Stay on me! I'm scared! I got the Dark Harvest deck. Holy! God, I have 11 stacks. Am I good? What the hell? I meant to press one. I pressed two. I meant to press one because you can place down wards while you're recalling. So I'm going to fill this slot up with a big rod. How many kills do I have? 
I'm sorry, I couldn't hear. I was going through a tunnel. What did you ask? How many kills do you have? Oh, yeah. I, I have currently right now. I, I currently do. Hold, I'm in an area of... I, I don't have good... Give him the old CC lock, baby. I had to get out there, though. It's pretty sick. There's a fucking vision cone there. Out. Weirdo shit, man. Oh my God, there's a Shaco. Do you think Riot has ever hit up Shaquille O'Neal to try to make a Shaco skin? Do you think they've ever just like reached out, just like sent him a single email? Who do I main? I'm usually a caster main, uh, caster mage mid laner. Don't call Zoriana Zillion. So close. I deal no damage, man. I actually can't deal any damage because I'm dead. You play Nico? No, I didn't really like her back in the day. She was very one-dimensional. I like it was only one combo to do. Didn't really like that. I wonder if Snoop Dogg gets raid Shadow Legends sponsors. I mean, he, he, you know, everybody in that space was doing a lot of NFT sponsors. So, like, I imagine, you know, they're, like, kind of parallel. Like, what is the overlap of people that get NFT sponsor uh, offers versus people that get raid sponsor offers? You know what I'm saying? Like, there's got to be a massive overlap of that. Because, like, dude, during the height of NFTs, during during the height of the NFT era... I was getting $250,000 a week worth of offers. A week. For like two, maybe three months straight. They're just, they're just phishing emails. Like they're not real people like sending it to you, right? They're just bots. You know, just, just, just sending you out garbage. But yeah, it was a lot. Maybe not quite that much. Maybe on a good week it was 250k, but it was a lot, dude. I don't know. I was like in whatever bot database for whatever. <laughs> I don't know why. Like it was crazy. I don't know why I was in like... Because like some of my content creator friends, they didn't get that many offers. I don't know what it was. Maybe it's because I'm like the whitest guy in the friend group. Maybe. Maybe it's just a bot that just tracks down white guys with sure SM7Bs and sees if they want to promote garbage. It's because you regularly scam your viewers? Black Legion, thank you for the 12. 
I give it the 12. In one time, I've scammed. Your team has destroyed a turret. Dude, I got 14 assists. I did my job, man. Decent KP. Alright, check this shit out, dude. I'm the damn streamer, I get it. Kiss me, why don't you? I can imagine it now. YouTube, dude, today we are playing Rad Ape Collection, where you can convert your amazing NFTs into in game items. Like that? Is that good for you? What dragon is this? Chemtech? Chem tank? Plus one cannon. Huge. I'm the fucking streamer. I'm the fucking streamer. Protect me! Protect me! We're gonna throw. We're throwing, we're throwing, we're throwing. Never mind, Caitlyn is, um, existing. I would ask for a refund of my five years of subbing if you ever advertised NFTs. Would it be polite, though? Would you, like, write me, a, like, an email? Like, a kindly worded email? Dear Frost, I am not happy with your NFT sponsorship recently. I am not currently happy with your acquisition of such heinous things. Would you send it in 100 bits to make sure that I read it? <laughs> oh, man. Thank you for subscribing. Frost who pays. Get it, it's the funny meme. Dear Frost, fuck you. Here's the bill. Hey, chat, it's been a fun day, dude. It's a short day, but it's been a fun day. Only a four-hour stream today. Hunt, huh? thank you for the five gift. Don't think I was mad at you, man. I'd only be mad if you had refused to turn it off. But even then, it's a fucking custom game. Like, as long as you didn't use it, I don't know. Anyways. Um... Short stream today because it's like 65 degrees outside, 70 degrees, 69. Let's call it even 69. Um, so I want to go spend the day out with Hannah. She had a rough day today. So I'm going to go spend the day outside because tomorrow it's supposed to be snowing. So I'll probably be streaming for a, a longer amount of time tomorrow. Tomorrow is the last stream for two days because I am taking Friday and Saturday off because I'm getting cool tattoo, which I got photos for. And I need to uh, get back to them about the photos. Um, which are, they're pretty cool. They're all right. One has a cat. What the hell? One of them has a spider cat. It has a spider cat. This one's pretty good. I kind of want to change the text of amazing. I don't want to say amazing because he's not the amazing Spider-Man, right? He's he's not. Yeah. That looks pretty sick, though. That looks kind of sick. That's literally his name. Into the Spider-Verse Spider-Man is the amazing Spider-Man? I don't think that's him, right? Is that a different comic? I thought that was different stuff. I thought there were different Spider-Man and not all of them were considered the amazing Spider-Man. Or am I wrong? 
That is from The Amazing Spider-Man? Wait, really? Either way, I'm not really in love with the word amazing. I would rather have, like, leap of faith or something. But look at this guy. Look at this one up there. He's up in the corner, and he's got his boombox. <laughs> that one's up in the corner with his boombox. Either way. Anyways, I will see you guys tomorrow. Thank you for hanging out today, Chad. I really do appreciate it. Um, I'm going to go deal with that shit. But uh, I'll be back tomorrow morning, early in the morning. Much love to you guys, all right? Tomorrow on the stream, what are we doing? What are we doing on the stream tomorrow? We are playing uh, farming YouTube content. Because <laughs> we need more YouTube content. So I'm farming some YouTube content tomorrow and some Slay the Spire stuff. And then we're going to be playing Returnal for the first time. Because I've never played that game. And apparently it's a good roguelike, even though it's a, a triple A game, if I'm not mistaken. So, either way. Peace off, chat. Have a good night. Stay safe. All that shit. Drink some water. Have a good one. Peace, guys.